happy Sunday. Well, if you're on the VOD channel, it's probably not Sunday. But today should be really fun, really chaotic. Lots and lots and lots of rules. But I, I think I did enough legwork to ensure that this series of streams, this challenge will be a lot of fun. We kind of beta tested it. If you watch that nine hour stream, was it in the nine hour stream? No, 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 no. It, it was the chaos mage one we did before, but that was rudimentary. We were just getting our feet off the ground, but it was so much fun that I knew we should probably do a full challenge. It's New Year's Eve. So if you're watching this on the VOD channel, this is how I am ringing in the new year by just doing the same old shit. How is everybody? My sound alerts are off. Uh, the only one, the only one that I know isn't working 100% is the, uh, the, uh, like the tip jar. I can hear them, but the way I have my audio sources set up, it's like on a separate sort of thing. It's, it's hard to like build its own audio source, if that makes any sense. How was everybody? I appreciate you all showing up here today. This should be a lot of fun. I'm missing my bears, which could be a good thing, could be a bad thing. Depends on how the game goes, but I'm missing my Chicago Bears playing Donkey today, which Kong makes me sad. You're in urgent care? Oh, babe, Crusade, I hope you're feeling better. Bees, thank Donkey you for the five Kong months. Sir. Happy five months to me. Another five months. Couple of jokes. Thank you. Um, so we have a lot of rules for this challenge. If you guys remember, it was a couple of weeks ago. We did the chaos mage thing. We did it for just one stream. It was a very brief challenge, but I remember saying throughout it, gosh, this could use a little bit more refining and it would be perfect. It would be so much fun. So the past few days, I've been sort of trying to put together a really comprehensive rule set. This is the most in-depth slideshow I have ever put together for rules. We'll go through it in a little bit, um, and then we'll start the challenge. We'll see how far we can get today. It'll probably take, I think, three streams because I want to get 20 hours of, you know, I want the challenge to take place in sort of a 20-hour block. That way we'll get a ton of stuff covered and hopefully get a little bit of pressure, but it, but also it's enough time to Thank you, kind sir. relax a little bit and Happy explore New how it goes. Juvent chat. <clears throat> Almost been here for an entire year now, and it has been a blast. Well, we're about to ring in the new year together, buddy boy. Well, technically not. I'm not going to be live until midnight my time, but some of you in chat, if you're on the other side of the world, may ring in the new year here if you would like to. All of you are living in the past. It's 2024 now. You know what, Connor? You don't have to flex on us from the future. Ooh, if you are in 2024, can you tell me, um, is Dragon's Dogma 2, uh, is it awesome? I assume it'll be pretty awesome, but if you're in the future, you got these answers. Am I CST? Yes, I am CST. So right now for me, it's 12.39 p.m. Uh, we have, this is going to be fun. So I've built out the rule set in a couple of ways for you all to engage with it in different ways if you so choose, right? Like every individual kind of rule as we go through it has its own slide to highlight the different things. But I also have on slide number two, exclamation point rules, if you want to check out the slideshow of all the rules, it is in total 22 slides. Thank you, kind sir. Uh, Inky, thank you so much for gifting one. Buddy boy, thank you very much for the prime. Thank you for 11 months. Um, but on slide two here, I'll just I'll, I'll briefly just pull it up for a second and then we'll do like the full classroom presentation. But on slide two, I did just do a text dump of the rules. If you want like the overview or if somebody comes into chat two and a half hours in and they don't really know, there's a lot of rules. There I is kind, the top half of the rules that is just sort of the basic stuff. The top half of the rules pretty much covers what we did in our last video. 
uh, in our last stream with one, maybe two little changes. There's like the general rules, and then there's the part two rules that go much more in depth with a lot of the things that will pop up as we go along. I also did this because when it comes to actually making the final video, I would rather do the general rules, start the actual challenge, and then sprinkle in some of the bonus rules because I've noticed something that I do, I tend to do a lot in my videos, which is overload with information right at the start. Every septum. <clears throat> Had to bury my grandfather today. Not in the best of moods, but a good stream is exactly what I need today and I can't think of any other places to spend than here. Also, bear down. Bear down, Mr. Father. I'm very sorry to hear about your grandfather. May he rest in peace. Thank you for spending your time here. Thank you for sending a thousand bits. I appreciate that. Very sorry to hear. Um, damn. Damn! That sucks. I'm sorry. Thank you, kind sir. Umg seven months and happy new years. Umg? Why doesn't text-to-speech just say OMG? Umg? Umg seven months and happy- Happy new year, Smo. Thank you for seven months. Shidota, thank you for the tier one. Uh, man, I- I'm really excited for this, though. This is going to be really, really fun. Uh, we have some contextual stuff that will help, I think, aid the viewer experience. Like in the top of my corner of the Thank screen, you you'll see my gold sir. right above my head. 22 month sub on New Year's Eve 22. sounds like the setup for a math problem. 22 months is a lot, and that does sound like a math problem. If Jerry has 22 months um, and Tom is at two years, how many years total do they have combined? I just got Cyberpunk 2077. Enjoy, Densmore. It's an awesome, awesome game. I want to do, actually, I have a save. When Phantom Liberty came out, I played Cyberpunk all the way up until the point where I could start Phantom Liberty, and I didn't start it. So I think in a couple of weeks, I'd like to do Phantom Liberty on on stream i think that that would be a lot of a lot of fun i have no idea how it goes or what happens i've played through cyberpunk i think twice now i've just never done the expansion dragon's dogma 4 is way better connor you're too far in the future at least Thank hey at least we made it to dragon's that. dogma 4 sick but still going out drinking with my best friend downtown toronto Inky, enjoy. I've never been to Toronto. Would love to go to Canada at some point. I haven't, I have not <laughs> traveled enough. I don't have time to play all these games properly. I, I know, no one, no one does. There's too many damn games. Too many. <clears throat> Hex and Beast, thank you very much for the 10 months. And also DB, thank you for 22 whole months. I haven't caught a stream in a bit in your chat setup now. Look, I like it. I mean, we still have, we still have the night show, which I love for some of the dumb Easter eggs that are kind of around here, like Mickey and Jabo up there. The fucking, the War Thunder billboard guy. I, I forgot his name, Gary Charlie. But I do like this one. It's, it's very immersive. I love immersion. Have you ever played the game Barony? Just started getting into it. Dungeon crawling, RPG, permadeath, road like. Uh, I've never played it. But that sounds fucking sweet. Connor's so far ahead of us, but Elder Scrolls 6 still isn't there. Yeah. Yeah, who knows? Traveling feels like a chore to you, Lily? It kind of is. I... There's a part of me that does enjoy it, though. Like, it's kind of cool to be in, like, one place and then all of a sudden be like, whoa, I'm already here in another place. It's like fast travel. <laughs> it's like, wow, fast travel was so cool in video games, they made it real. Uh, have I played Hogwarts Legacy? I played very little of it. I played it for maybe two hours, and I realized that, A... I don't care about Harry Potter anymore. I never really did. I, I read the books when I was like 10. Loved the movies. Um, and I was playing the game and I was like, I, I don't really care. I don't know. It was, it, I just didn't really, I didn't really give a shit about it. 
Haven't caught a stream in way too long. Vods have been keeping me going through some tough times. Good to be back. Maddie, good to hear from you. Hope you're doing well. And that's no problem. That's why the uh That's why the VOD channel exists. You're free from JK Ring. Yeah, also. <laughs> What's your favorite nine Bethesda Every games? Share 1009 New Year, Juve. It has been fun being a moderator for your channel, and I look forward to continue being so in 2024. Okay, let me finish my. Let me finish my coffee. Is it? That is weird when something. I'm holding something green and the green screen takes it out. Thank you, kind sir. Ah, but Ink Demon, thank you very much. Thank you for a thousand bits, and thank you for hanging out with us for the last year. Oh, you meant non. Oh, 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 your favorite non Bethesda game. Um, I mean, gosh, honestly, I haven't even beaten it yet, but I probably have to put BG3 up there. It's got to be up there at this point. It's like, it's so fucking good. Um, I've only completed Act 2. I've played through Act 1, I think, three times now. Maybe four times. I have a co-op save with my friends. That's a ton of fun. We haven't. We played. Uh, we did like two I sessions, but so. with that kind of game, it's so hard to like get everybody together for a full session, and then you really have to commit time to it. Uh, Red Dead Redemption Two, absolutely love it to death. I'm a god. How can you kill a okay. god? What a grand and intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet mm. uh, Inky, I appreciate that. Thank you for gifting five to the channel. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Um, of my oh, Mercenaries, Playground of Destruction. If I had to pick like a classic game, it's not really even a classic, but it is a bit of a throwback. It's sixth gen, right? Is the original Xbox? That's sixth gen, right? Xbox 360 would be seventh gen. <clears throat> Mercenaries Playground of Destruction, uh, GTA San Andreas. Gosh, you give me an open world sandbox and I'm probably going to enjoy it. Mercs 2 is crazy good. I think Mercs 2 is so overrated. I, is that a hot take? Because I always, you know what I always see from people is they'll say like, oh, Mercenaries 2, it's the most underrated game ever. And I get upset. I was... 13, 14 years old when Mercs 2 came out, and that was the first time I had ever been, like, disappointed in a sequel. And then retroactively, nowadays, I see so many people that are like, Mercenaries 2, it's so underrated, and I'm like, the original was better. The original had a better map, better factions. I, you know what? Actually, I haven't played Mercs 2 in so long. I can't even make that judgment. I'm going off of what I think I thought at the time, and that's where I'm pulling this from. Life is Strange is a really good game. Ooh, I would say uh, Telltale's The Walking Dead. I absolutely adored it. Um, season 3 was eh, but it ended really, really well. And I enjoyed it quite a lot. Tales from the Borderlands, probably my favorite individual season uh that telltale did wolf among us was also a great gosh telltale was like cooking but your choices didn't actually matter i don't care they were compelling and awesome jade empire never played Thank jade you, empire time, sir. i won't be here for the stream but i hope everyone has a good <clears throat> time and happy new year happy new year kenny my favorite gaming series is Mass Effect. I have played Mass Effect 2 all the way through. I think I was 15. I got almost the entire crew. Spoiler. Spoilers if you're still in the middle of playing Mass Effect 2. I got the entire crew uh, at the end of the game basically killed. What's your experience with RuneScape? Guys, I just started playing RuneScape again. <laughs> I just started playing again three Thank days you, ago. Time, sir. Happy New Year's. Also, did you know Pope Gregory the Ninth declared war on cats? Because cats bore Satan's spirit. That way that's true. Pope Gregory Cats Satan. 
Get the fuck out of here. Um, Assassin's Creed, I just found your new papal, uh, Templar. What? Gregory the Ninth, the cat-killing pope who laid down the law. What? <laughs> this is from Irish Legal News, written by Tom O'Connor. That's about as Irish as it gets. Pope Gregory the Ninth, the 178th Pope of the Catholic Church from 1227 to 1214, you, is often remembered. Happy New Year. New Year? New Year? Miss Paprika, thank you for three months. Pope Gregory the Ninth, the 178th Pope of the Catholic Church from 1227 to 1241, is often remembered for issuing a papal, papal bull, papal bill, declaring that cats bore Satan's spirit, which subsequently led to a huge number of cats being killed throughout Europe. Man. <laughs> I shouldn't laugh. I should not laugh. Okay? I've killed many a cat in Fallout during these challenge runs. I should not laugh at that. We should have a reverence. Have you ever played Detroit Become Human? Uh, I Become Human? I have not played Detroit Become Human. I never had a PlayStation. I've never owned a PlayStation in my life. Um, but G-Pop, thank you for nine months. Kenny, thank you for 13 months. Uh, when? Oh, I, I'm, I'm scrolling up to like older messages. How long until merch drops? I have no clue. What would we even put on merch? Because I've always thought I would love to do merch. But I don't have like a mascot. Um, I, I don't want like if I did merch, I don't want it to be like I don't want you walking around with I'm wearing YouTube merch chair no Ed, see every streamer has chair i feel like every streamer's chair gets hyped your face on a mug okay that would be kind of funny that would be kind of fun let me think oh there's one other thing i needed to ask oh i can't play the audio does anybody know what stream it was somebody sent me an audio clip of me out of context and i said something about me having the confidence to let the wind flow between my man boobs does anybody know what stream that was from? Because hearing that and knowing that it was cut and left out of a video makes me sad. I'm really upset that we cut that. I know, I know. It was a very strong quote. Not that I would put that on a shirt. It would be kind of a funny shirt. I let the wind flow between my man boobs. Turns out there are two wood elf sisters who always fight together. Lucid Knights, thank you for gifting two to the channel. You are very kind. It probably, I mean, there's a 50-50 shot. It was a Skyrim or a Fallout 4 stream. All right, you guys want to start this challenge? Or at least start the presentation of the rules? Because there are a lot of rules. Thank I'm going to need you all sir. in your best behavior. Inky, best behavior. Thank you. I do always say that I hate this game. When I say I hate a game, that means I secretly love it. Um, but I need you all to get out a pen and paper. Take notes. Focus. Pay attention. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? What a grand and intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet Sarah my dance moves are getting more and more minimalistic as that thing keeps going. Inky, I appreciate you so much. Thank you for gifting 10 to the channel. Hope everybody has had a wonderful holiday season. Inky, you especially. Let's do this. The Chaos Mage Challenge. We've already kind of done this before. We're going to split up these rules. I will try to make these rules as digestible as possible. So the first half of these rules will be fairly simple. All right, stick with me. Slide number two. These are all the rules, most of them laid out in text form. Just in case you need a refresher or if you hop into the stream and you have no clue what's going on. If you would like my mod list, exclamation point mod list in chat. 
However, I do have a few tweaks to my mod list since the last time. I'm using Ordinator instead of Adamant for a perk overhaul. I'm using Apocalypse for more magic spells to be thrown into the game. I had to move a few things around because when I nuked my game, uh, it was really painful. I have three versions of Skyrim, four versions of Skyrim now downloaded on my PC. It's getting out of hand. In this challenge, there will be 318 spells in total in our game, 198 dungeons. These will be the main players during this challenge. 318 spells, 198 dungeons, potentially. Now for the rules. We will start each round by spinning the wheel and selecting one of the 198 clearable dungeons. That's an important distinction. The dungeons that we are selecting from have to be able to be marked cleared on the map. After we select a dungeon that we will have to go Thank to. You, kind sir. Happy New Year, everyone. Once again, please chat, behave yourselves, please. Please quiet, quiet. Thank you, Zap, 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 Thank you. After we select a dungeon, we will select one of the five magic types at random. That's alteration, conjuration, destruction, illusion, restoration. After we have selected our school of magic, we will then spin for a massive wheel. I made a huge spreadsheet with all of the spells in the game, and we will get three spells from the school that we are locked into, including restoration. So we may not have a lot of firepower during some aspects of this. The three spells that we get, that will be our loadout. Now here's where it gets a little complicated. Bear, stick with me now. We must only use the selected spells that we had. We'll favorite them so it's easy for everybody to understand and, you know, sort of see visually in the game. We must only use those spells to clear the selected dungeon that we got. However... Because I could get unlucky and have a completely non-combat loadout of spells, hand-to-hand -hand will be allowed at all times throughout the challenge. No other melee. So I can punch you, things. Kind sir. Howdy there, Juve. Howdy, Robot Twinkie. Just further visual proof of all of the spells that are in here. Conjuration is probably the worst of them all in terms of variety, because they're all just conjure different things. Our final goal is to clear as many dungeons as possible in under 20 hours. I said it earlier that the rules were about to get complicated, but now the rules get very complicated. Uh, if you are reading the rules as part of the YouTube video, skip these rules for now and get into it. Oh, that, that was just a note that I left for myself uh, so that later on we can just sprinkle in the more detailed rules and get right into it. Now, for the part two, for part two of these rules, pay attention now, focus in, remember these terms, perfect clear, spell selection, spell slots bonus, rerolls, and gold. Those are the five important forms of currency as we go through this challenge. Perfect clears are pretty self-explanatory. We just have to get through a dungeon without any deaths. If we clear a portion of the map, if we clear our selected dungeon without dying once, then we are granted some rewards. What are those rewards? If we get a perfect clear during this challenge, I will be given one temporary spell slot on top of my three so that I have four, and I will be given one reroll. A reroll can be used on the dungeon, it can be used on the School of Magic. Or if I want to, I can re-roll the three spells that I have within that school. So let's say I went into a dungeon with Restoration. I have a re-roll available and I decide, you know what, I'm going to stick with Restoration and just re-roll the three Restoration spells I have. This will make sense. This will make sense. When I unlock a temporary spell slot, I may manually choose the spell that takes up that fourth spell slot. It must match the current school of magic. However, hear me out. I'll need to explain this a little bit. 
Let's say we clear our first dungeon using restoration. Those three spells that I've sele that I had to use in that first dungeon for restoration, I'll still know them so that later on, if I have an extra spell slot and I want to choose a spell, I can choose from the spells that I've already had. If, if that's not available, then I'll just re-roll and roll for a fourth one. Upon death, I must choose one spell to remove from the loadout. So if I have a temporary spell slot and I die, I get to choose which of the four spells I get rid of. That means that if I have a perfect clear and I've earned a temporary spell slot, there's still some kind of reward. I don't immediately lose the award that I got for a perfect clear, because if I manually choose a spell to go into my loadout, I can get rid of one by my own choice. So that spell that I manually threw in there, I can keep it. Just for that one dungeon, though. So it keeps a little bit of that perfect clear reward. So really the challenge Thank is about can, trying sir. to get as many perfect clears as you we can. Happy New Year, buddy, you the best. Oh, relax, Chet. This is not that complicated. You'll understand. You'll understand. It is going to make sense. All right, now for rerolls. I start the challenge with one reroll that I can use at any times, but I can obviously collect more if we get perfect clears. I explained it earlier. I can reroll a dungeon. I can reroll my three spells, or I can reroll which school of magic I am using. Spells will be removed from the wheel if they are selected. Then they kind of go into our bank, which we can select if we get bonuses. And now for the golden economy. Um... So I am allowed to go throughout the open world and loot if I want to progress. Let's say I get stuck on a dungeon and I want to make some progress, level up a little bit. I'm allowed to go around the open world and fight some stuff. I cannot use dungeons, though. I can buy a respin with 2,500 gold. And in terms of crafting, let's have Iron Man rules apply. So I can't go to the merchant and buy crafting materials to power level smithing or power level enchanting i can i can craft and i can loot but in terms of like you know crafting rules we'll keep it relatively iron man and last slide a couple of bonus rules i am allowed to checkpoint in dungeons i'll try and avoid it if i can but if a dungeon is really really hard i'm gonna allow myself to checkpoint throughout the dungeon either by like a quick save or sleeping, whatever it is. Crafting alchemy is banned. Purchased or looted potions are allowed. And then we may add one or two more things here. And then the rest of the slides are blank. Now I know that was a lot of information. And I know it was a lot, I, I know, I know. Oh, also one more thing. One more thing I didn't note. Our character is starting with uh, 400 Magicka. We're playing a High Elf, and we start with 400 Magicka. That way, I have a lot more access to the spells that may land in. Makes sense. You will be tested on this information. It will be worth 95% of your grade. <laughs> no, this makes no sense. No, it'll make sense as we go along. Just remember the key thing throughout this challenge, right? Remember the key thing is that we want to clear out the dungeons without dying. That's it. We're forced to use a limited selection of spells. We want to clear dungeons without dying. That's it. We want to get through and get perfect clears. Make sense? If you have any other questions, please refer to the slideshow. If you have any very specific questions about very specific things, we will cross those bridges when we get to them. I think I have everything I need to begin. You weren't I taking notes. Oh, why weren't you taking notes? I told you to take notes. They Pudis man, thank you for the tier one. Liam, thank you for the tier one. Thank you for 13 months. Did I miss any other ones in here? Uh, Robot Twinkie, thank you for the prime. Now we're all caught up. Thank you, kind sir. Happy New Year, Juve. Sad New Year. Kyo Kane. I'm just playing. Thank you for five months, Kyo Kane. Let me pop out the activity feed here.
so that I can hopefully not miss alerts as we get into this. Thank you, kind sir. Hey, Juve, Happy New Year. Okay, I'm five hours early, my time, but so what? Dark Child, thank you for the prime. Five hours early, your time, so that means it's 7 p.m. your time? You're in the UK, Ireland, um, Spain? Is Spain in that same zip code? <laughs> I'm gonna fail streamer school. Oh, Thank we will be able to gamble. Sir. I just told my wife about how genius your business model. What business model? Phage Prime, thank you for the three months. Oh how can you kill a god? What a grand and intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet Zarabar. How do you whip again? Is that how you whip? Is that a whip? Like that? Thank you, kind sir. Blue Bud, thank you for gifting five to the channel. When will you go over the rules again? Never! The bears are up 14 to 7? That's what I'm talking about. Why is it not playing? Why is it not playing? FreeCreditReport.com Well, I was shopping for a new car. Which one's me? A cool convertible or an SUV? Too bad I didn't know my credit was whack. Cause now I'm driving off the lot in a used subcompact. F R E E, that spells free. Creditreport.com, baby. Saw their ads on my TV. Thought about going, but was too lazy. Now instead of looking fly and rolling fat, my legs are sticking to the vinyl and my posse's getting laughed at. F R E E, that spells free. Creditreport.com. This stream is sponsored by FreeCreditReport.com. I'm not sure if they're still open or not is free credit report still a thing free credit I'm a god. report how can you kill a god damn it inky intoxicating innocence i'm a god how can you kill a god shame on you sweet Zarabar. inky i appreciate you thank you very much uh yeah no free credit report.com still exists y'all that's still a thing so yeah, they, they need to start paying for that. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna need them to start, you know, hitting me up. Uh Inky, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Alright, you guys ready? I've already made my character. Oh fuck, my speed run timer. Thank you, kind sir. Time out. Time out, timing out. Thank you, kind sir. Time in. No, it, no. You, you can't just do that. I'm not letting you name the character. I'm not. Speaking of Harry Potter, I already named the character. <laughs> I already named him. Uh, Nerps, thank you for 23 months. Oh man, I didn't even pull up my wheels. I didn't even sh I didn't even do an example of the wheels spinning. Okay, time out. Time out, time, time. Pause. Pause, hold on. I forgot to even show off the wheels to you all. I mean, look at this. Look at how many there are. Okay, this, like, okay, we've got. I mean, we could just get right into this. We could just get right into this and spin for a dungeon. Let's do this. Let's just spin. Let's just see what our first dungeon is. There are a shitload of them on here. What do we get? Come on, give me something easy. Let's just start. No. Hilgren's tomb? Is this one going to kick my ass? Hilgren's tomb. I don't know where that is, but thankfully, I have the interactive Skyrim map. Hilgrund. Hilgren's tomb. Uh, it's a Nordic ruin. Nordic Ruin just west of this area. 
Uh, it's just east of Whiterun. It's actually not that far from us. Wait a minute, we've done this one. Holy crap, holy crap. This could actually be easy because this quest, this starts us off with a quest. We've done this dungeon before. Uh, we have to take that guy, Goldier. So this might be possible. However, it all depends on the school of magic we get. <laughs> okay, what, if I get destruction to start this off, that's huge. If we start off with destruction, that's massive. Wait, 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 wait. Why did I why did I just immediately roll for destruction? That's not how this works at all. <laughs> that's no. No, that's 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 not how this works. Come on. Give me destruction. Conjuration is also really easy. Conjuration. That is huge. Huge. Conjuration is huge to start with. So now it, it, it gets a little complicated. There's going to be a lot of spinning. I need my three conjuration spells. I'm going to make sure to put them in chat. They're all going to be just conjure. Can I afford that? Conjure Wrathman? Conjure Wrathman. Put it in chat. Conjure... Wrathman. Revenant. I have no idea what that one does. Conjure Wrathman, Revenant. Come on, conjure cat totem. No! Atronach Mark? Atronach Mark. So one thing about this is I do have these chests right here that contain all the spells. At least the apocalypse spells. Oh, and there's Atronach Mark. Atronach Mark, Conjure... Wrathman might be vanilla, it's not in here. What was the third one? Revenant? Revenant might also be vanilla. Let's just make sure I give myself these. Player.add item. I have to give myself the spell tome. F2. And I gotta give myself Conjure Wrath Man. What do these even do? We'll start the timer in a little bit. I also have to give myself, uh, do I have my magic at the right level? It's at 150, so no. Player, uh, uh, Magicka. I think I want to set it to 350 because I'm a high elf, which gives me an extra four. Yeah, so now we're at 400. And these cost, Atronach Mark is 64. Marks a target for 10 seconds. The mark detonates when struck by a summoned or reanimated minion. Dealing magic damage equal to 15%. That could be good. Atronach Mark could help. Wrathman we can afford. We have Conjures. Revenant. Reanimate a dead body. We might have actually really lucked out on the first one. How am I cheating? Y'all need to relax. Okay, I'm not cheating. Oh my god, he's huge. Harry Potter, <laughs> he's massive, or Harry Potter. I'm gonna save. I'm not sure what y'all are gambling on. We're gonna go right for this first dungeon. 
We're going to try to do it clean in one rep. And... By the way, let me know if the things above my head are not readable. The death counter in the dungeon. Go. We've got the gold counter in the top right corner. Time out. Wasn't playing on survival. Runs dead. Dog. As you all know, of course, we're playing on survival expert. Ooh, crap. You know what? I actually think before this dungeon... I should get to work a little bit and then make some quick and easy gold. I think that that might be a little bit more beneficial for me. Where's the chopping axe? Axe, axe, it's on this table. Got it? I need clothes. It's, it's snowing already. If we're playing on survival, I'm going to be screwed. I'm not remaking my character or restarting. Thank you, kind sir. One more month for stream, baby. Huzzah. Drop stitch, you got a name? Because if I don't approve of the stream baby name, <laughs> I might have to, <laughs> we'll have to, we'll start aborting stream babies. No, not funny. Okay, why twice? Do I have to pay stream baby child support? Y'all better not put me on the hook for that. We could loot or we could craft our clothes. God, I'm already hungry. I just want to get us some regular gold. Off to off the start. Oh, you know what we could do? Actually, get stop! I don't want to chop wood anymore. Come on! I'm tired of looking at his back. It makes me feel self-conscious about my lack of back muscles. All right, who do you sell the firewood to? Is it the inn? No, I wasn't. Next time, you might want to get dressed before leaving the house. I thought he was gonna ask if he saw me talking to Sven. Said he's gonna insult my nudist culture. That's even worse. I should kill Feindal. We got rooms and food. No. Drink too. I You're that visitor, okay, which which one of you needs the wood? Until yeah, next time. Lumber mill. Oh! Duh! Of course it's that's a lumber mill. I knew that. I was testing you, chat. I was testing your Skyrim knowledge. Okay, that's not the lumber mill. That was another test. Here for work. Honest gold. Honest work. Okay, 70 gold. <clears throat> let's go with. Yeah, let's go, Wrathman. How much magic is that? It's about our entire slot of magicka. But if we go up the road here, I'm already getting cold. I'm already walking really slow. There's the introductory wolves right up the road here. Let's get their uh, leather, their pelt. God, listen to those footsteps. They're just splapping and flapping. They're like flippers. Where are the wolves? Ah, there they are. Do you imagine if I died here? They're up the hill. Ooh. Time out. I'm glad I came up this way because I want to grab the mage stone. <clears throat> Just an update on your bears. 21-7, two minutes before halftime. Don't worry. We're a first half team. They'll find a way to muck this up in the second half. They always do. Okay, mage stone. That's clutch. I can't go into and clear this dungeon up here. But at the very least, I could summon and take out the guard on the outside. <clears throat> I 
All right, Wrath Man. Come on. Don't be shy. You both are so shy. It's kind of adorable. Thank Get her. Kind, okay, Wrath Rat Man. Whoa. <laughs> okay. All right, we might get through this first dungeon all right. Plenty of poisons in there. I don't have any use for them, but can make some good money. Bite to eat, lockpick, some armor. Definitely going to need armor. I'd rather have enchanted robes, though. Something that refills my magicka quickly. Okay, watch it, wolves. Get him, Wrathman! Wrathman! I love you, Wrathman. Heck ye, three months. Small cat, thank you for the prime and for three months. Another wolf up there. Let's just sick another Wrathman on him if we can. You might think that this is easy so far, but wait until I get stuck with restoration. No, Iron Man, uh, Iron Man rules only apply to my own crafting in terms of if I want to craft things, I can't just buy materials. But armor and whatnot, I can loot. You guys got to let me have, you guys got to let some things go my way. Like if I wanted really good enchanted gear, I can't just buy and spam stuff. If that makes any sense. Is there any way to deal damage with the restoration? Yes. There are some combat restoration spells, but if I can't find any or I don't roll any, Deck Taurus, thank you very much. That was very kind of you. Apologies that the audio doesn't play over stream, but I did I did make sure to catch that. Thank you. That was very kind of you. All the way from France. I think that's the first France message we've got. France mentioned in chat. To anybody who's who's here who here is from France? Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, ra relax, Wrathman. You don't get to no. You don't get to go to the store. Okay, you're not the guy. I'm the guy. The Riverwood Trader. Some they call this junk. Me, I call them. Oh man, I roasted him so bad he immediately just died. Uh, I'll save the wolf pelts. I don't need the woodcutter's axe anymore. Oh, we could start off with. You know what I should try to do is. Brawler's Iron Gauntlets. Yeah, we're going to take... Uh, can I afford them? I cannot. We're going to want the Brawler's Gauntlets. Oh, God. And there's already robes in here. I'm going to want one of every single one of these. One of each type of robe. I better get back to cleaning the store. Let's save our money for now. I'll use my gold on rent, food... And then we'll go hit that first dungeon. Hopefully get through it without dying one time. Small cat, thank you for three months. Named Ragnar the Red, who came riding to Whiterun from Ulrich's stead. Let's say that appetite. Something did something in bold he would make. The boastful is something and something no more. Talk to Delphine. Careful with that. Don't tell me how to manage my salmon. Skyrim NPCs are always so worried about how I handle my meat. I'm the innkeeper. Sure thing. It's yours for Thank you, kind sir. Chief Vampire, what are people doing for New Year's? Empire? Since when are we an empire? Uh, but what are we doing for New Year's? I don't know. I mean, I'm doing this. I might go hang out with my parents when the stream is over. Got myself a Skyrim tarot deck for Christmas. And so then came clashing and slashing steel. 
Use better words than that. Then what? Meat? No, it's my meat. It's like a stream. A streamer's job is to litter their speech with innuendo throughout, and then to have chat make fun of them. It's part of the job. It's what we do. God, my game looks so good. Oh wait, why does this fur armor look dope? Why does this look cool as fuck? This might be the coolest looking high elf ever. <laughs> this might be the only cool looking high elf ever. Oh no, he's hot. <laughs> Oh. Let's see, let's test out. What's this other spell we got? Revenant? Or is it Atronach Mark? Oh, you know what? Okay, Atronach Mark, if we combine it with Wrathman, I think that just buffs Wrathman's ability. Thank you, kind sir. Happy New Year, Juven's chat. Yeah. Oh my god, this guy's insane. He's got a giant bone club. No way, I'm boning the enemies. Awesome. See? Just like that, Chen. Ooh, this is gonna be kind of a long run, though. Should I try? Ooh, should I try and kill the guards here? How powerful is the Wrath Man? I think I'm going to test it. Although if I die here, by the way, just to clarify the rules, if I die here, then that counts as me not getting a perfect clear on the dungeon. But we're going to go for it. Let's just see. We might as well take advantage. If we have a powerful spell, let's use it. Citizen. If you know any no, we won't free them yet. Let's get Wrathman up. Wrathman goes up. I believe my game just crashed. <laughs> I see we got too smart for the game. The game was not ready for that kind of a play. No, I've got an issue with my load order, for sure. There's so, there's something in my game that I haven't done the work to try and figure out yet. Yo, by the way, so I posted a, a I made a community post yesterday. Oh, by the way, I'm not kidnapped. I'm not being held hostage, okay? It was a joke, somebody took it seriously, but I made a community post basically saying I wanted to do another AMA because I haven't done one in a while. And uh, I really was not expecting as many people to comment on it as they did. There were like 450 comments on it. Like there were a lot. Also the green screen looks terrible right here. Sorry about that. Let's see if I can make that a little bit better. Damn. Don't worry, I need to fix that. Um, but there are a lot of those. So I'll try to go through as many of them as I can. Anyway, all right, let's free this Stormcloak. Timer back on. All right, here's the play. We go Stormcloak. No, 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 no. Wrong order. Ah, fuck. No, 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 no. Ratman, go. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Oh man, Thank if I blew you, it there. Sir. Finally time for our stream baby One G. down? I think I'll name them Elder Scrolls Vi. Come on, Wrathman. He's insane. He's insane. Wrathman. I love you. What, what are you doing? <laughs> Why are you going after him now? Come on, don't. Leave him be. Although if I'm technically in combat, let's steal some XP. All right, all right, you know what? I can't control Wrathman. I'll let him do his thing. Yo, you better get out of here, dude. Run back to Ulfric. 
That's it. That's all you've got. You gonna take that? Last witness killed. Wrathman, you're a monster. Why would he do that? Why would the Stormcloak go hostile? Makes no sense, but... All right, now, remember earlier when I was explaining the rules. Let's take the arrows, just because they're, like, kind of free money. I, might, I guess I might as well equip some of this. Helmet? No, I'm not throwing that helmet on. It looks stupid. I really don't care about the stats. Um, so let's let's do another little sort of talk about the rules. I'm a god. I'm of course. I'm a god. What a grand and intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. I was gonna. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet Zarabar. No selling armor for gold. I mean, I could. I'd like to just save on the wait for now. Never know what we'll find in the whoa, dungeon. Um, but in terms of the meta of this challenge. Remember. Ow. Oh, fuck. That did a lot of damage. Uh, we gotta be careful here, y'all. I don't have any healing. It just hit me now. I have no healing. I don't have any spells. I don't have any potions. I am allowed to loot and use or buy healing potions. So we do need to be careful. But we want to get a perfect clear here. Because now that we've pulled Wrathman... If we get Conjuration again in the future, and if we have an extra spell slot available, I will manually be able to bring Wrathman back into the picture. That's why getting a perfect clear here is so important. There it is, huge. This guy's insane. This is the first time I've ever started a challenge with good luck. I'm not letting it go to waste. Oh no, what is that, a quest? Uh, studded armor, that's an upgrade. It doesn't look as cool though. Should I be showing off my chest? 25? <gasps> they have the same stats. When in doubt, wear the cool one. target now I'm not going to use any of the soul trap methods for just grinding conjuration I do need to hurry up though I don't want it to take you know 45 minutes to get to the first dungeon <clears throat> I do want to try and find a bed though we're getting a ton of a conjuration XP Careful. Careful where you're swinging that thing. He has a dragon weapon. Every single time. He's wildly overpowered. But that's how this challenge is going to go. We're going to have a mix of really overpowered, underpowered, help me. Help. I'm just grateful we got lucky the first time. Why don't you use this stuff from the camping creation? That's a good idea. I've never used it. It's, al it's always been in my game. I've just never used it. Uh, true, if we're able to clear this out, we should be able to nap. My only issue is I don't want to get smoked by the sea. Look, they're already gearing up to shoot me from... Oh, they're shooting at the deer. <laughs> Run. Let's try and sneak. Closer I can get to them, closer I can get Wrathman engaged in combat. 
the faster he can take on the whole fight for me. I'm giving myself a checkpoint here. Also, was that my phone going off? Uh, actually, I don't think they're hostile until this first person attacks. Yeah, you're gonna have to get through him if you want to get to me. You're gonna have to hand over, say, 200 gold if you want to use our road. Yeah, how about I kill you? Huh. Tough talk for someone who's about to have their guts spilled. And go. It's time to die, dog. I love you, Wrathman. I've never been physically attracted to a drugger. I'm still not. But this is the closest I've ever felt to it. Get going. Yes, murder away. Healing potions, big time. One lock pick. Okay, we got a lock in here. No, really? What? Come on. Big correction, it's Apprentice. Got it. Two more heals. Let's get those favorited. Is it not? It's not keeping my FOV anymore. I hate that. All right, he's pushing. He's clearing it out. Oh my gosh, he's just one tapping them. Oh shit, they killed him. That was close. Get out there, Wrathman. Wrong way. Perfect, let's get them in here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, come on, Wrathman. He's getting his ass kicked. Ooh, there's two. Had a boy wrath push up. Nice. Anything good in here? Not really. A black face mask is probably kind of cool. Oh god, my why does my beard have to clip through it? <laughs> Never mind. Not cool. Getting rid of it. Oh god, don't ever do that again. I think the bed is on the other side of the bridge. Oh! God! Oh, no. Whew. Whew. Where did it hit me? I knew it. I, I, I knew it. I knew it. Crap, I'm going to have to burn these potions. I really don't want to. I knew I could I knew if I peeked once he would fire and then if I peeked a second time the delay in range would end up hitting me What do I do here? I, I need to get the level up Ugh, That could be a bad call Let's at least get Wrathman shot at first Anyone in here? No one in here. This room's cleared. Oh, there's a bed right here. Can I take it? Yes! Looks like I wasted those potions. Uh, do I take a health buff? Or do I keep boosting my magicka? I think I should not do magicka at the start. Let's go with health. On the off chance it saves us from getting one tapped, we'll go with health. Stick with what we have for now. Make conjuration just a little bit cheaper. Any potions? Damn one. There's going to be a rewards chest on the other side. Doesn't look like they see me. Let's push. 
Don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Whew, that was close. Wrathman, away. Go kick ass. Take the pickaxe so we can start getting some crafting mats. Nice, target down. Uh, this could also be good if we end up getting transmute. So if we pull alteration at any point, it's a good idea to hold on to it. Any skill books? Let's not break it on a fucking novice lock. Helmet of archery. It's decent money. Take the XP out of the way. All right. Pretty much in the clear. One of these bandits should have a lockpick on him, right? What was the gamble, by the way? Was it two dungeons under a certain amount of time? There's my lockpick. Corundum. Corundum ingot we can make a backpack with. Let's get that chest up here open. And then I'm gonna make my way to our objective. What am I doing? I'm all over the place. Nice. Amulet of Kinnereth is a really nice find. Quick stamina buff. Not a lot, but it'll make some use. Three dungeons in 90 minutes? All right, who saw it? Come on, who set that one up? <laughs> who took, who bet on Believer there? I still have to spin for uh, the next few dungeons we do. And I got to walk there. My internal goal is 15 dungeons in 20 hours. <clears throat> but it feels good not having to re-roll this first dungeon. I want to get through this first dungeon. I want to have an extra spell slot. I want to have two re-rolls. If we're able to stack up some re-rolls, I might burn them just so that we can have extra spells in our, like, manual slot to choose from. Unfortunately, I can't list everything on the screen. Rerolls, spell slots, all that. It'd be nice. Let's get this. Check our corners. Just in case we get jumped, Wrathman. Watch my back. Your game looks insane. So I'm using... It's actually a fairly light uh, graphical combination of stuff that I'm using. It's... Skyland all in one and then community shaders If you go to the community shaders page on Nexus There's like six or seven things listed there water lighting stuff like that It's just those two I think it's up here This is not a very easy dungeon though this could get tough I can't afford to get hit at all. Luckily, we're gonna have an NPC here. Ah! Oh, my kind, you startled me. There's a necromancer around here, so watch yourself. Can you help me? He's in the tomb doing God's know what with my dead relatives. Yeah, we've been here before. Necromancer in the tomb doing some objectively sketchy things to his dead relatives. Val's, he's gone. My aunt went in after it. Great. 
Can you help me? Yes, yes, we're going in. Healing. Salt pile. Take those for cooking. In case we want to get really meta with it and save some cash. We should get after Val's Baron before he does more damage here. I'm gonna check every single urn just in case we pull a ring. Oh god, already? Oh my god! I cannot believe I just let he just walked through with a power attack. He split the middle and goes for me. Great start. I'll waste an hour and get my health back. Wrathman, get out there. Kick some ass. That's how a true Nord fights. Not fooling me. Let's get through this. We're getting so much conjuration XP. Doesn't this guy get upset because we're like robbing his family? Get out of the way. Wrathman, I love you, but I need you out of the way. Oh, I hate this. Good work, good work. The more boring the dungeon, the better for me. No way. We got brawlers. I don't care. Your family's helping me out. Okay, I've got some combat viability here. Yeah. <laughs> got my first kill. Why didn't I go in with her? Sorry if you're lost. Does she have anything good? Ooh, Karanda Mingit. Gods only know how he's defiling the bodies of my ancestors in there. He makes it sound like what he's doing in there is so much worse. He's not fondling them. He's just uh, summoning them and making them do his bidding. Who's opening my garage right now? You're you're really messing up my audio. Visibility potion that could come in handy. We're making good time here. I'm just a little afraid. Not gonna lie. Just a wee bit scared. Oh, shit. My main fear are the traps. Want to watch out for traps. Anything that could blow me up. Anything that could explodify me. If we take care here, take care. If we take care here in this first dungeon. It's only going to help us out in the long run. Sorry, Chad. I have to be a little bit locked in here. Oh, 
Oh shit, when did the timer die? I hate live split. When did the timer die? At least three to five minutes ago? All right. Are you lying to me? Chad, am I being lied to? Okay, we'll set it to 33. Thirty-three thirty. Is that fair? Everybody okay with that? I can hear Galdir screaming in the background. Oh, okay, that's Wrathman. Get as much XP as we can out of this. Goldier has a lot of health. Wrathman still attacks relatively slow. So one problem we're going to run into in that final room. There's a lot of ranged attacks. A lot of ice spike getting shot. I get hit by one, maybe two, and I could be toast. So the final room of this dungeon is going to be pretty brutal. So far, so okay. We're always gonna recast every time. Let's try Atronach Mark. Ooh, there's a lot of them in here. Oh, okay. Hey, 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 hey. Back off. Back off. Don't make me. Oh, okay. You wanna fight me? I've learned how to fight. Oh, he's running. Wait, does Atronach Mark make them afraid? Yeah, uh, he's gonna walk into a trap. Got eyes in the back of my head. Even though I was technically looking forward there. I got eyes in the forward of my head. Let's let Wrathman handle it. Silver ore could be useful for making some jewelry. Denhead, I appreciate you. Thank you. Here's to 2024. Why is my health so low? That's not good. Seven potions of healing. I gotta save them. Let's wait an hour, see if we get our health back. No? Oh, wow. Okay, let's burn one. I thought that waiting for an hour would give it back. One thing I want to try, if we have a wrath man up... Can we get a Restless? Can we have two at the same time? Nice shot. No. Okay, so it looks like Revenant gets rid of Wrathman. So we're just not even going to use it. She said that the bear would show the way. Wow. What a complicated puzzle. Really throwing me for a loop there, Goldier. But we'd better keep going. 
Why would you even be cryptic about it? Yeah, just pull the chain. It's right by the bear. There's a chain. There's a chain there. It's, n it's not complicated. Why would you expect me to be cryptic about this? I want to feel like I'm in. Oh, come on, guys. I want to feel like I'm in involved. <laughs> I can't even put a dent into Wrath, man. Thank you, kind sir. Mr. Monk, thank you for the prime. Okay, here we go. Final room. Oh, don't. Does that locked door take us around a secret path? <gasps> oh. Huge. Especially because at some point during this fight, our Wrath Man's gonna get killed. We're gonna have to call in multiple. Or Magicka. Five potions of magic, eight of healing. Eight times 25. I have about 200 health worth of healing. Let's go into this with full health. No point risking a one hit kill. Now, I'm not going to save scum, right? So when I start this fight, if I die, I come back to this point. The way this fight works is it's in several phases. He's going to bring in a bunch of enemies. Goldier's likely going to go down, but not die. Goldier's going to get back into this fight multiple times. The easiest way is to take out the... Gosh, I don't even know what the easiest path is. The easiest way is just going to be able to get Wrathman up there. Hopefully he's not getting stumbled constantly because he hits really hard. But there's our target. Definitely going to be an enemy out of there. There's a ton of other Draugr he calls in. It's a pretty epic fight for the most part. I don't know if he has dialogue here. You with them. Sovereign Guard is a myth, you swit. And now you can join your ancestors in service. To we do get that magic back really quickly after Wrathman. Okay, fight starts. I just have to make sure that I don't get flanked. Thank you, kind sir. Hi, Jules. Happy New Year. There you go. Restless Draugr down. Couple of them are still shooting arrows. Goldier's almost down though. I like that ability. Oh shit. I gotta get Wrathman right there. Woo! Oh man, that was close. Come on, Wrathman, push him. Smokes him. He does enough damage to make him reset. I'm gonna miss Wrathman when we have to get rid of him. Drag her down. Now they fall. Let's fall back again. Reset Wrathman on the stairs. Yeah, he also revives. Overlord? Ah, oh, shit, I just hit Gold Ear. No. What just hit me? I think it was a shout that hit me. I'm running low on magic, though. Let's get our magic back. Some of it. Gold Ear's down. It's all on you, Wrathman. Come on, light him up. You got this, buddy. You got it, Wrathman. One more. a boy. No. Get away from me. Brown rot? Oh my god, he's actually just targeting me. Why? I got you right where I want you, Vals. Corner him. Come on, Rath Wrathman, he's right there. Go, buddy, go! <laughs> go! Get his ass! 
Ah, uh, he keeps going after his little minions, but not him. Don't shoot at me. <sighs> Rathman, be a little bit more productive. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. He's down. Uh, I'm not sure what Rathman's hesitation is. No, 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 no. Stupid ass Draugr. Come on, Rathman. Is he down? Yes! Rathman, kiss me. Celebratory punch. 500 gold, chest key. None of his stuff is enchanted, which is a bummer. But we'll take his gold. Quest complete. Filled soul gem. Can disenchant that. Nothing. Nothing real good. I lucked out. I really, really lucked out. We got a fairly manageable dungeon. More importantly, a dungeon that I knew the layout of. So I kind of knew what to expect with that fight and how to take out Val's Varen. An obscenely overpowered spell. Where are we at on the map? Hilgren's Tomb. Cleared. Zero depths. Let me know if it updated. One dungeon cleared. Where's my victory tune? I don't really know which one is going to work, so. Well, I was shopping for a new car. Which, which one's me? A cool convertible or an SUV? Too bad I didn't know my credit was whack, because now I'm driving off the lot in a used subcompact. F-R-E-E, that spells free. Creditreport.com, baby. Saw their Thank ads you, on my TV. Sir. Thought about going, but was too lazy. Now instead of looking fly and rolling fat, my legs are sticking to the vinyl and my posse's getting laughed at. F-R-E-E, that spells free. Credit report. Nah, no point taking the spell tome. Okay, one dungeon down. We got a thousand gold. Um, you know, at some point we could probably buy a reroll as well. Really good start. We do not start off this well. We never do. We don't start off this good. Is it good or well? Everyone say goodbye to Goldier. Wave goodbye to Goldier. We will miss him. Now the timer pauses. The timer pauses here. Why? Because I have to say goodbye to the spells that I currently have. I will... They will be learned still. Uh, so here's a weird thing about this challenge, I guess, is... Yeah, I guess I'll console commands the spells that we end up getting on this next roll. Also, I need to catch up on alerts. Danny Darko, uh, thank you very much. Let me catch up on some of these that I missed during that fight. Sorry, I had to be so locked in <laughs> during that chat. Um, I appreciate you all bearing with me. I wanted to start off this challenge, though, with a win. I never get enough wins to start. Danny Darko, thank you for the tier one. Raspberry Cat, happy new year to you. Thank you for three months. All right, sweet. I didn't miss a ton there. That's good. I love your YouTube channel. Glad to be finally catching a stream. Thank you, Danny. I appreciate you. So we're going to pause the timer here. Because we got to go and jump over here and figure out where we're going next. One dungeon down, 197 left. How can we... No, why? What? All right, what do we got? Round two. Thank you, kind sir. Not Stillborn Cave. Swindler's Den? I think Swindler's Den might be easy. We might be two for two. Oh my gosh, we are lucking out. We're two for two. 
Swindler's Den is right by White Run. It's not very big. Now, it depends on what spells we get. Let's not let's not count it as a win yet. So Swindler's Den. If we get destruction, then it might be rigged. Give me destruction! Go! Yes! Thank you, kind sir. Whew! Hello, Juve. Hello, chat. I didn't spell destruction wrong. That's the European spelling. Did not that that's the European spelling. It's like when they put another E or U in the word color. Huge, 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 huge. And we still have to get three decent destruction spells. And they could be too expensive. Unbounded freezing. No idea what that is. Take note of that one. Unbounded freezing. Fracture. Unbounded freezing, fracture. Flame cloak is huge. Oh, we're going to cook this dungeon. Unbounded freezing, fracture, and flame cloak. Okay, I typed it in wrong. Oh, F3, FE. Okay, unbounded freezing, fracture. I get a fourth spell. Oh shit, there are higher thugs right in front of me. <laughs> oh no, it'll be good for training. Thank you, kind sir. Unbounded free. What was the third one? Unbounded freezing, fracture, flame cloak. Thank you. Kind of hard to search for cloak because there's so many variants of storm cloak. It's got to be in book. Spell tome. There it is. So we got our three spells. Flame Cloak, Fracture, Unbounded Freezing. I get a fourth spell because we just did a perfect dungeon. We got through it without dying one time. And now I have two rerolls. I know, I know, it's a little complicated, bear with me. And we'll, it'll, it'll start to all come together. Let's get those favorited. Get healing, can't use it. The fourth spell has to be a destruction spell. Rift Bowl? No clue what that is. I'll take it though. As we keep doing this, we're gonna figure out which spells we really, really like versus spells that we don't like. But so far, so good. Help bolt. It's gonna be all. Oh, uh, here we go. Book. Spell Tome, Rift Bolt. DB26. All right. 
Now we're set up with our new loadout. We've got two re-rolls in the bank. We've got our four spells. I need to read through these spells and figure out exactly what they are. I'm going to start the timer as soon as I start dissecting these spells and learning what they are. If I do get Conjuration again and I have my extra spell, I'm just going to pick Wrathman. I, I got to have Wrathman back. All right, Flame Cloak. 60 seconds, opponents in melee range take eight points of fire damage per second. Targets on fire take extra damage. Swim unharmed in freezing cold water. That one's not very good. Oh. I don't think that that one's very good because I don't want to be in melee range. I don't want to be getting attacked. Fracture, a layer of thin ice deals five damage to health and stamina. The ice shatters for 35 damage when struck by a different frost spell. I have unbounded freezing. A freezing wind envelops the caster, knocking down nearby enemies and freezing them for 50 points of damage per... Whoa. Okay, that sounds awesome. And Rift Bolt deals 20 shock damage to health and half of that to Magicka teleports the target backwards. It looks like Rift Bolt and Unbounded Freezing are going to be our best. The only problem is they're rather expensive. But it's a quick dungeon. I forgot the name of the dungeon already, but it's right by Whiterun. Frida, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you're holding up all right. Thank you for the 100 bits. Appreciate you. All right, I'm about to be attacked by hired thugs. Let's, let's just... I don't want to get cornered. I got to have some room here. I need to test this out. So how does this work? If I just hold this down and walk into them, is it going to... Ooh, it does, oh, okay, it does knock them over. It ragdolls them a bit, but it's really expensive. Huh? Knock them down. Snipe them with all oh, that's actually really cool. I don't think I have enough magic, though, to take the higher thugs on the whole way. It's also really dark out and hard to see. It is really dark. I, th I think you all might be able to see easier than me right now. That didn't teleport him. <laughs> That's so cool. Come on. New favorite spell. It's really expensive, though, so I can't cast it for very long. It's an effective defensive spell, though. I like it. Okay, okay, Skeever. I feel bad, but should I use it on the goat? Poor guy. I think he's dead. So I can just cast this repeatedly. Nice little backpack. Throw it on for now. Yeah, this spell rocks. I don't know who I pissed off. But once again, we're two for two. I feel like I should amend the rules and not try to go over four spell slots only because having five or six spell slots is going to get a little bit. I'll be keeping track of a lot of information in my head. Thank you, kind sir. Let's take advantage of this camp. We cleared it out earlier, so let's hit it. Sleep so it's daytime. I can see a little bit better. I miss Wrathman. Does anybody else miss Wrathman? Zweeblejack, thank you so much for the tier one. And Moon. Thank you. Thank you, Moon. 
We're gifting. What was that? Was that three? Thank you, kind sir. There it is. I appreciate it, Moon. Thank you. We need Wrathman merch. It's a little bit too early for Wrathman to start getting merch. If, if Wrathman gets merch before me, that's crazy. Remember that time you punched him in the face? And that other time you punched him in the face? That was a love tap. Come on. You got... That was clearly a, just a way of me supporting him. You know, it was like a... You know, I appreciate you. Bam. Thank you. Bam. Thank you. Uh. That's how my dad used to tell me he loves me. <laughs> bah! This is for your own good. Do we go with Magicka or Health? I feel like 400 Magicka might be enough. <laughs> Juve dead for the win. Yeah, I'll probably keep going Health. That's going to help us out. Obviously, Destruction is the one we have now. So let's spend a perk point on Destruction. And let's take the first restoration skill point. Those give us... It gives us some protection against a bad roll. We're using Ordinator, by the way. That's our perk overhaul. Wait, am I still tired? There's no way I'm still tired. How? How? I just slept for 12 hours. In a king-sized bed. In a tower that I claimed. Regardless, let's get moving. Uh, we do need to take care of the disease that we caught. And now we saunter on the roads together. This is a peaceful journey. Wait, why am I not, why am I not hunting? This is really useful for hunting. It teleports them back towards me. Lost in fate, thank you for the prime. Did I miss that one? I think I missed that one. I appreciate that. done a lot of walking here just gonna protect myself sell cans of soda you know I, I definitely wouldn't want to sell soda it's your favorite von sleeper how are you Jim? fritz mclovin you know i love vod sleepers how are you i'm doing uh i'm doing well honestly i'm doing who are you get away from me I've been wandering alone for so long, I thought I'd never see another soul again. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, it's funny. It's funny. Go. I don't know what she was scared about. Oh, but no, I definitely wouldn't want to do soda. Because I don't really drink soda. Maybe a coffee. I don't know if I'd be able to license anything though named a Juve because of the there's that red light therapy. They might have a patent on the name. I should try red light therapy though. Reach out to him, be like, hey. But red light therapy is a thing that like NFL athletes use. <clears throat> Murder of innocence isn't funny. know what kind of Elder Scrolls you've been playing. But it totally is. K 
get a load <laughs> get a load of this guy he doesn't kill innocent civilians and elder scrolls that's that's like saying you follow the traffic laws in gta like what no you're playing you're playing the game wrong yeah the red light company uh is juve with two v's somebody asked where my name came from uh, it's a shortened version of a garage band I played with in high school. That's the Cliff Notes version of the lore. Whoa, whoa, wait, hey, <laughs> wait, come back. I'm not running all the way over there. I'm not that desperate for venison. about destruction that's tough it's so hard to train the conjuration trains incredibly quickly that gave us a really good start but destruction's a bit slow Does anybody remember the name of the cave we're supposed to go to? I know it's west of Whiterun. Swindler's Den, thank you. If you're not really sure about what the rules were playing with here, exclamation point rules, the second slide gives you a bit of a rundown. What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Go home to your mother. This might be easy. We'll, we'll see when we get restoration or alteration. If I keep getting conjuration and destruction, though, this is going to be a cakewalk. Gosh, there's so many deer. Not enough range. Let's take the iron, though. Just on the off chance we get transmute. Hey, did you guys know that if you hit the ore... Oh, that's right around's retreat. Where's the Swindler's Den? Did you know if you hit the ore with your pickaxe, it goes faster? It's not this one, is it? No, Transmute is uh, not Silent Moon's camp, the one that's just east of it. But we can't pick up spell books. This is not Swindler's Den. Oh my gosh, this is easy. Uh-oh. This is so overpowered. Guys, I might have made my challenge too easy. Ooh. 
I'm gonna take that to disenchant. I'm running a little bit low on carry weight. So we need to be careful. <clears throat> Dustman's cairn. Where in the where's Swindler's den? What does that spell? The spells we have right now are Rift Bolt and Unbounded Freezing. I believe they're a part of Apocalypse. Ooh, careful. Saber Cat. Closer to Rorik said, God, it's it shouldn't be too far. Bit of a peaceful walk though, isn't it? Thank you, kind sir. JT Baker, thank you very much for the Twitch Prime. How are you? Appreciate you. Hope you're doing well. I need to be careful here because my sleep. Thank you. Kind my magic's sir. not going to return very quickly. Riri, how are you? Thank you for the tier one. Stop and smell the roses. Guys, I only have 19 hours left. I'm not gonna stop and smell the roses. Swindler's Den, got it. Who was that? <sighs> do you know who do you know what I am capable of right now in this moment? Now ain't this a Yeah, we really, uh, <laughs> we, we really lucked out. I might have to get rid of my bonus spell slots. Uh, that's right, Swindler's Den does have quite a few people. Why would you wear the bag on your head? That provides you no advantage. Zero. No tactical advantage. Mom? Mom? Let's see what you look like. Okay, he's ugly. He's ugly, he's ugly. Put that back on. Put that back on. Can I tell him to equip? Oh, God, I can't make him put the... Okay, you know what? Just do your own thing. Let's rip through this dungeon. I'm so ready. That was close. Oh my god, they all do it. Hey, <laughs> this place is haunted. Okay, they're all gonna come through this tunnel. This is way too easy. J 
Chat, we have a problem. I've trivialized my challenge in the first hour. Uh, they do have a mage up there. I could present an issue. Come back here. Come back here. Arrows? Whew, close. You gotta be kidding me. You know what? I'm happy. I'm happy. Because this was too easy. But unfortunately, we're not getting another perfect clear. I gotta get rid of a spell now. Uh, I'll probably just get rid of Flame Cloak. Uh oh. No, 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 no. See, this is where things just cascade into negativity. Real quick. Don't act like you cared about him. Ooh, yikes. Okay, out of magic. How am I out of magic this time? Uh-oh. Oh, no. okay, hold on. We gotta recharge. Why is the mage the first one? Oh, well, that scared the hell out of me. What? Go back to sleep. They kind of have a tactical advantage up the tunnel from me. They all have arrows. Oh, man. Really? That's going to be a one hit again. Missed. You're as good as dead. They're too afraid to push me in the hallway, which is what I need them to do. They're just sitting back there. What kind of arrow is that? What kind of iron? Oh. What does that mean? Stop being cryptic. I could possibly dodge the arrow if I cross and hug that wall and then immediately hit them with frost. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stupid. I can't peek. Okay, he does put the arrows down. That arrow, okay, so no arrow notched in the back. Okay, they put the arrows down. Now's our chance. Yes, 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 yes. I was nervous. I, I actually was, uh, I was not sure how this would go. Just get me out of this dungeon. Get me to two. Unreal. Is there a bed in here? 
Ah, there is. Skill book? Yes. Let's take our level up. Get a ton of sleep. Health again. And then I'm just going to take the first alteration perk. So we have the first perk in all the magic trees, depending on which one we land on. I have severe brown rot now. Okay, all right. First order of business. Get out of this dungeon. Take care of our disease. Turn this ship around. You have 20 minutes? Well, I have... I hate this game. And a chief. Okay, he's only using melee. That is why we invest in health. Arrow almost killed me. There goes all my healing potions. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 no. No, now, now it just gets bad. I did say I'd allow myself to checkpoint. So I'm not breaking the rules there. Oh my. Oh me, oh my. It's not, it's not Jover. Okay. Anybody have an update on the bear score? How we doing? Alright, Bandit Chief, come on down. Come on down. You are our lucky winner. Thank you, Tom, sir. It is Joe Ever and it's 26 to 10, start of the fourth. Uh. Ah! Where did you learn to do that? I want to speak to your man. Ow, that arrow. That's a nice shot. You Thank hit me you in the shoulder. Hi, Juve. Hi, chat. Found out yesterday that I'm going to have a real baby. Can I get a what what? Everybody clap it up. Congratulations, Mephodius. Mr. Feather, thank you for two months. Thank you for the update. Bear down. Mephodius, thank you for six months. Congratulations on the baby. I believe that's two dungeons down. I don't want to hear any more complaining. Although, geez, we barely made it out. Minor conjuration. Ooh, that could be pretty good. I think this is the first time on the channel I've ever worn a circlet. Get some health back. We have to get to town and get a cure disease potion. There's more of you in here. The spell is almost too easy. Okay, that's got to be it. Yeah, this person's dead. Let me double check. Cleared. Two down. There we go. Easy. An hour and 13 in. Pause. Timer pauses. How many deaths are there? What is that, three? No, we only died twice. We're good. So unfortunately, since we died, I did not get a reroll. I have two rerolls in the bank. And I only get three spells on this next one. Let's keep it rolling. Where are we going next? <clears throat> Dungeon number three. Give me an easy one.
Rebels Cairn? Red Runs Retreat. Thank you, kind <sighs> sir. Good luck and best wishes for 2024 to everyone. Uh, this one sucks. <laughs> That's really bad for the believers. Red Eagle Redoubt? Actually doesn't get us. That's one of the tougher ones. I might have to re-roll our magic. I'm going to give this one an honest try, though, with whatever magic we get. Really? Destruction again. I don't know why that... I don't know why getting destruction again kind of, like, disappoints me. Red, Eagle, Redoubt. Yeah, I was going to say, so Red Eagle Redoubt is a bandit location, and I believe that's where you get the sword for the Red Eagle boss fight. Well, we still have to see what destruction spells we get. We could get, like, flames. You never know. We have to go with fate. So let's see what we get. freeze that sucks i mean maybe it doesn't suck <clears throat> freeze don't give me flames oh my god frostbite i mean it it works but that's also not very good freeze frostbite we're getting all ice spells Cyclonic Rift. Fingers of the Mountain. Give me something cool. Flame Strike. Wait, Flame Strike might be badass. Flame Strike, Freeze, Frostbite. That's kind of hard to say. Flame Strike, Freeze, Frostbite. Flame Strike. I don't see the spell tome in here for freeze. So I'm just going to add the spell. All right, so we got freeze. Frostbite. Oh, I still have to use the spell tomes. Oh yeah, Flame Strike is badass. Okay, so Flame Strike, a storm of 24 Thank meteoric kind, fireballs sir. rains down from the heavens in a line extending from the caster, each exploding for 171 fire damage. It only works outdoors though, but I believe that this place we're going to is all outdoors. It's extremely expensive though. It takes like all of our Magicka, but we get to Carpet Bomb. So that's pretty cool. We get a Carpet Bomb. Freeze. A spike of ice that does 21 points of frost damage to health and stamina and slows the target. Okay, so freeze is just frost spike. And frostbite looks like it's just the normal freeze spell. Timer starts. Now. 
I just want to see what this nuke looks like. Kind of underwhelming. Uh, but we have an opportunity. Uh, I think our, our location is right around here. Fastest route is going to be running. Northwest. Fastest route is going to be on foot. Ah, oh, crap. I need to get my potion. If I cure my disease, then that means the believers lose. I know where to go. I know where to go. You just have to trust me, believers. Okay? I'm going to do my best to try and win this for you. Got it. Okay, I ended up finding this way earlier than I thought. You afraid of me? Oh, shit. Uh, okay, uh, let's try this. That was awesome. <laughs> that was much cooler than I thought. Cure our disease. Uh, ooh, I do not know what that one is. Looks like another freezing spell that just surrounds me. What does frostbite do? Oh wait, that was the wrong one. Freeze. I don't want to get one tapped again. Can I get him on the other side of this? Yeah, they're gonna do a lot of damage. Yep. Mm, not as much damage as I thought. That's so much harder. I actually have to be precise with these ones and oh my god! I'm running. 90 minutes is the goal. If we're on a half hour pace, that's really good. Guys, I suck now. I suck now. I suck now. That arrow's gonna come flying towards my cranium. I'm wasting all my healing potions. Might be worthwhile to stop in Rorikstead real quick. It's gonna be just past uh, Golden Hills. 13 and a half, oh, chat, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry to all the believers, it's just not happening. <clears throat> Bumble word, I appreciate it. Thank you for the 100 bits. You had a dream of myself and Mr. Beast fighting over a green and blue blanket. That's pretty strange. Oh, God. Okay. No. No. I have no interest in fighting you, Mr. Ghost. I'm going to hit Rorik's dead. I'm going to sleep. We'll level up. Resisted freeze? Oh my goodness. Okay, well, can he resist carpet? If this ghost follows me all the way to the inn. You. Stop working and help me. Somebody help. I was the one asking for help. <laughs> No one, no one, no one here. I'm going to get in trouble for this. I will do what I must to protect my village. Run, kids. <laughs> Sorry. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Looks like that's it. Got to go. You know how much skill it takes to carpet bomb a village? and avoid casualties. Come on in. That was a surgical strike. It was a, uh, it was like, it was precise. Mind yourself with that fire. Sure thing. It's yours for, I'll show you to your room. It's actually pretty immersive. I about burned down the entire village. He's like, hey, watch it. Um, I definitely don't want it to be nighttime. I hate exploring at nighttime. Do I go health again? I'm gonna need to. I'm gonna need to throw like every level into health. 
Restoration, destruction. Do I go rank two with it? No, you know what I am gonna do? I'm gonna keep putting perks into the weaker ones. Yeah, I'm gonna use my perk points on the two terrible skills. Because if we somehow get like mage light, I'm not gonna know what to do. So don't go adding to them. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ooh, wait, hold on. Can I sell to you here? Take a look. Ah, there's nothing like fresh air and on. What's he got? Uh, this is all stuff I want to disenchant. All right then. I spend every day tending fields, and what Take do my look. daughters do? There's nothing. nothing wrong with a little adventure. Complain and caterwaul, sleep and eat, it's useless. Until next. Okay, food real quick. Catfish, rabbit. Good to go. Not sure what everyone in here is crying about. Don't say hey, watch it. Fire, right? We're actually not that far. Can we kill Lemkill again? Guys, we can't kill Lemkill every time, all right? Because if we kill Lemkill every time, then the act of murdering Lemkill, it becomes less meaningful. I have to say, having spells that are not strictly defensive is terrifying. Sneak up on your prey. Dude, we can do this. We can time this perfectly. I am just going to double check and make sure. I missed. I missed. I missed. Oh, God. Really? Ow. <laughs> Please. For the love of Christ! Uh, uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Kitty Cat. Forgive me. Oh, my lord! Should slow him down a bit. I, if I get killed by a wolf, I'm never playing this game again. Never playing this game again! Okay, well, we're not getting through this one with a perfect clear either. Looks like our first dungeon, the hardest dungeon. See, it's that easy to airstrike a large cat. Okay. Okay, you know what? I don't need magic. All I need are my hands. Stupid wolf. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> it's far too fun punching things. All right, seven and a half minutes. Is that Red Eagle Redoubt? I don't think it is. I would go TMM1 and reveal every map location, but that does feel a little bit cheesy. No, this is not it. Yep, yeah, no. Uh, Red Eagle Redoubt, it is a fort though. Might be up here. Oh my God. Get the rocks in his way. Rocks are in his way. Rotate. Rotate. He's going to push. Oh my god, the wolf killed me. The wolf killed me. Get him. Let's go! That's right, Mother Nature. Suck my magical cock. Mm. 
What a win! Woo! I am alive! Giving myself a checkpoint after that one, okay? I ran out of healing potions, though. That's a problem. Brief invisibility. We might be able to use our invisibility potion to our advantage. I think this is going to be Red Eagle's cave. It is, 100%. Rebel's Cairn. That airstrike spell is really, really fun. It's a really high risk, high reward spell. Takes up almost my whole Magicka bar, but I really enjoy using it. It's fun. Although, damn, I'm going into this dungeon one hit from death. So I'm going to give myself a checkpoint right on the outside. I think this is it. No? Ah, oh, crap. There might be a bed in here, though, that's worth going after. What do you think, chat? There are beds here. It's Forsworn. We're already pushing. Oh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! Oh, thankfully you don't know how to pass. I'm definitely the bad guy if I'm calling airstrikes in on like the native woodland people of Skyrim. <laughs> They're just chilling at their camp. They weren't doing anything wrong. They were just worshiping Kinnereth, you know, enjoying their day. All of a sudden I show up like a calculated magical drone strike. This is bullshit. I can't claim to be the good guy anymore. The reach belongs to me now. <sighs> I need some Kenny Loggins in the background as my bombs come down. What's the one song in Top Gun? The Kenny Loggins song? <clears throat> I think he just walked past Red Eagles Redoubt, did I? I think this is it. There's an archer up here. Red Eagle Redoubt. All right, we got it. We're gonna have to be smart here. They've got archers up the way. Let's go back to frost. No, we don't want frostbite, we want freeze. That's bad. Nice. Really great. Yes. I'm dead. I think I can dodge the arrows. I have to walk close and slow enough. I know how to dodge arrows, though. I've got the timing decently memorized. Ooh, close. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. Nice, one down. I'm dying. Why am I burning? Friendly fire's on? What kind of lobby is this? I don't need the bucket. I mean, I'll take it. All right, I think we got the outside cleared. Should be safe for now. I only got a minute to go through this dungeon for the uh, believers to live, so you might just wanna, you might wanna accept defeat now, believers. 
It started off trivial, but it's only getting more difficult. Oh, and I can't use my crutch ability. Depending on the type of cave, though, the game might recognize this as outdoors. Let's give it a shot. Let's not. Hey! Why? Oh, he... Dang it. Gosh darn it. No. How are you both alive? I'm not dancing to anything specific. I'm just dancing to my own groove. Thank you. Who, who, and why, and where? Who, what, where, why? Bear trap. Bear trap. The amount of forsworn fuckery going on right now is, it is palpable. Unpalpable. I cannot palp what is happening. Turns out there are two wood elf sisters who always fight together. One down. Fire arrow incoming. Dodged, because I'm crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> you know what I will say? I have kept it in check throughout this challenge so far. I have yet to throw my headphones off. And I am not saying that to set up, oh, he said a thing and then the opposite happens. Okay, all right, I'm over it. That part of my career is over. I'm moving on from that type of joke. You're dead. Olive oil shot for the new year. Oh, don't, okay, that's overkill. Let's act like you've been there before. Where are these bear traps? Where are these bear traps coming from? Oh, I absolutely cooked. Ooh! Watch out for bear traps. One more Forsworn. I got an idea. Ooh, yeah, I got an idea. How do you see me? Oh, that's so stressful. Because with my health as low as it is, it just comes down to them dying before them releasing the arrow. Mods, if you're gonna do uh if we're gonna do another gamble, let's set it to a death count number over under number and a half. It has to be a half. That way there's a definitive win or loss and no ties. So do over under dungeon count and then death count, right? So over under nine and a half dungeons before or you know, over under X amount of deaths before X dungeons. Do something like that for the next gamble. And then make sure you set the lines on a half number. Because that way it will always be over or under that specified half. Give me a checkpoint. Give me a checkpoint. Yeah. Ah. 
I hate this. Another arrow right there. So awesome. The kill cams never get old. I love them. Could you explain that again, but clearly? Um, if we're going to do another gamble, set it by X and a half deaths before X and a half dungeons or something like that. Set it like an over under, like an actual gambling line. Here we go. They're pushing. Do I have enough time to set this off? Maybe if we use frostbite to slow them down. Only problem is now I'm out of magic. I gotta get it back quicker. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Ooh, free chest. Not quite free. Yeah, so like 3.5 instead of 3 or 4, right. X and a half deaths. Over, under, X and a half deaths before however many dungeons. It doesn't have to be a half dungeon, actually. That part makes no sense. Over, under, X and a half deaths before however many dungeons. Thank you, kind sir. Whoop. I would not have died there if I wasn't too busy explaining to you all how gambling works. How do you have a half? Do you not know how gambling works? I just explained it. <laughs> you put the number at a half. Therefore, when the bet finishes, there is a winner and a loser. There is no tie. That is why you use the 0.5. Come on, everybody, have you not lost hundreds of dollars on frivolous things? New homework assignment, chat. I need you all to sports bet next weekend. I need you all to come back to me with the bets that you placed, the Vegas lines, and whether or not you won or lost. I'm just kidding, don't do that. Don't do that, do not gamble. It's a waste of time. I don't even gamble. Why am I encouraging it? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I went for the execution and now I'm dead. No, no, down to a knee. Need something? Yes. And she died. Oh, this is getting bad. You gotta show the kill, you can't just skip it. That ruins the whole thing. You probably can. I need to get separation from this mage. I need more separation than that. Ah! Yep, yep, uh, I had a feeling that was, uh, okay. Injured, sure. Did you eat every single one of those? Ah. Huh. 
<laughs> George is getting upset. George is getting upset. Okay, I need to uh, save my nuclear surgical strike for the mage themselves. Mage can wait. The others can go down a bit easier. So here's the plan. First person right here is going to have a good shot on us. Maybe they kill us immediately. I doubt it, though. Nice. Stay out of combat, get our magic back a bit quicker. Help. Oh, man, that was close. Watch the flank. Okay, Archer's down. This guy's just got melee. Shouldn't be too difficult. <sighs> Close one. Although, damn, the higher up this mountain I get, the less health I have. Okay, what what's going on with the prediction? Who? who? We're gonna have to have fun. What? Okay. All right. All right. We're gonna have to have we're gonna have to have a meeting of the minds here. I'm gonna stand at this fire, warm up. I was gonna go inside anyway, so I'm giving myself a checkpoint. Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. There we go. Okay, this is not, this is not difficult. All right. There's a prediction. How do we do this? I don't even see a prediction on here. Okay. We're gonna start one. We're gonna go. Over slash under. This is the format. All right, I got, I got you. I got you. This is the format. Over slash under. How many deaths do I even have? Yo, how many deaths was I at? In total, what do we, what do we have? Twelve. Eleven. Okay, we're at eleven. Over under. Over under 20 and a half deaths before this will be our third dungeon before four dungeons. Over under over is for coward non-believers. Okay, well, I can't fit all those letters in there, so I'll just say coward. Under is for Chad. Mega awesome. Too many characters. Whatever. There you go, you get, I'll give you two minutes to submit. Thank you, kind sir. Thank you very much, introverted zero. Thank you for five months. Whoa, 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 this name is not compliant with our content guidelines? Is it because I said deaths? Over under 20 and a half Ds. We'll call them D's. Apparently, we're just calling them D's. Not compliant. How? I don't know. Is it because I said over under? There's no way. What is going on? Really? My computer decided to just open up Gmail. And close out all of all of my tabs. Okay, I'm. <sighs> Name the prediction. Okay, over slash under twenty point five death before four dungeons. Over. Under. Believer. Our prediction. There we go. 
There we go. Now we got it going. We're good. We are okay. Everybody relax. What's the score to the Bears game, by the way? I need a score here. I'm just checking on my own. 37-17. Damn. All right, Bears. Our season's pretty much over, but bear down. What I'm talking about, boys. How's our playoff hopes looking? Probably not great. Thank you, Karen, sir. Hey, Jovis Crust. It's Long 20 and a half no total. See, sorry, I haven't been able to make a few streams, but glad to be back. Uh, who was that? White Duke, thank you. Long time no see, sorry. Oh, don't, don't apologize for that. It's all right, we got things to do. Also, I left the timer running that whole time. Any gambles will be running on the overall death count. You bet wrong? Well, at least you bet. You actually can't gamble channel points if you're in a country that doesn't have legalized gambling. Wait, really? Come on, lighten up. Literally 19, that's actually 1984 right there. Right, right there. That is, that's craziness. Making my way downtown, walking past faces past, and I'm homebound. And I need you. Da 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 da, and I miss you. And now I wonder if I could walk, fall into the sea. Something, something, ah. and if I could just ah. air fuck strike. Where did I get shot from that time? I thought I had full coverage. I was trying to get around him and flame strike. Felt like I had good range to do so. I'm glad that the actual challenge of this has picked up though. Now I'm, I'm having a good time. I have to stay glass cannon for the most part to keep it challenging. You're chilly. Such a pussy way to say you're cold. I'm chilly. Just say you're cold, <laughs> you dork. Even though I say I'm chilly all the time. It's a meal. Okay, not a feeling. It's ground meat. Tomato paste. Beans. Cheese. Sour cream. That's chili. Okay, what's going on? Okay, what is happening? I've lost my nerve. Nice, that left-handed shot wrapped right around the corner. Sleep? Oh, oh god! Stop, stop, fire! No, 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 no. No, I hope none of you took the under. I have to get my health back. There's not a lot of options for it. That's what's really killing me right now. Ugh. 
Okay, we'll take out the first archer, second archer, and then apparently there's a mage right around the corner. I don't know where the hell the mage is coming from, though. Can we sleep in here? Oh, man. That's so bad. That's such. That's just such a bad oversight. My movement's gonna be slow, and I'm a lot colder than I was before. But hopefully, this at least lets me tank one or one more shot than I was before. All right, I'm not letting it get to me. I'm not letting it get to me. You see, kids, you know, in life, you are going to be faced with adversity. And it's about perseverance. I know that's a lot of syllables. All right. And I know we haven't really defined what a syllable is. But perseverance is how you push through adversity. One down. Don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. You. S where's that? Where's that? Uh, where's the third source of damage coming from? I don't understand where that's at. Because there is fire damage. There's an extra force worn here somewhere. Where are they? I see where you're at. All right, you can have this one. You can have this round. But I will persevere. At what point do you reroll? No, we have. If we have destruction, I'm gonna be able to brute force and push my way through it. She's in here. That easy. Okay, nice. That's an alteration level. Now the archer up there probably hasn't seen us yet. Is that all of them? That's all three. Now we're warming up. Okay. We're back on. We're back on. I can die five more times. We're going to clear out this dungeon. I'm about to get another level up. We need to find some mage gear, though. That's a problem. Honestly, can I get a Bowflex sponsorship? Not for my own body, but just for every character we play. A toned, sexy core. That's what they used to say in every... Does anybody remember Bowflex? I wonder, do, do commercials on TV, do they still do the thing where instead of telling you the actual price of the item, they'll say something like, order now for 17 low payments of $75.99. Cause like most people aren't gonna sit there and do the math in their head, but 17, pretty good. You know, it'll mostly be like, like, no, no one's going to sit there and calculate. Uh, I guess, actually, no. Even I, as a kid, I would be like, wait a minute. I'd be like, hold on a sec. Hold on. Wait a minute. Even even as a kid. No, no, I'm, I'm completely wrong there. 
We'll save the perk. We'll take our level up. P90X. I remember that. I've seen Juve 360 no scope dwarven enemies off ledges before. Is he under extreme distress today? I'm actually having a great time. I need the weather to calm down a little bit. But remember what we talked about. Persevere. Perseverance is the lesson of today. All right. Luck. And this applies to all phases of life. You know, perseverance. You did bad on a test. Persevere. You'll study harder. You'll do good next time. He thought he was going to heal his way out of it. You do bad on a test. You do better next time. That boss fight in Dark Souls is too hard. Keep at it. You'll eventually beat him. That TikTok you made performed really poorly. That's all right. You'll get him the next time. You lost all your money at the poker table. Well, that's okay. If you brought your pocket knife, you can escort the guy with the most chips at the table to the bathroom. Just be quiet, you know. Keep it low-key. Don't, don't be too loud about it. Just, you know, give him a little poke. Just say, hey, follow me. Follow me. You're going to act like that at my table? Okay. Sure. Cleared. Wait a minute. They're two separate dungeons. The the little cave one. Was already cleared. I just unnecessarily cleared a second dungeon. and wasted a lot of time. Well, I'm taking whatever loot I can get from this one. We are going to take that as a dungeon cleared. I'm not going to count that as a fourth dungeon because it was not in line with our rules. But I am going to count the deaths because everybody was under the impression that I was only clearing one dungeon there. No loot. Anyway, just remember not to let failure completely stop you in your tracks, okay? There is always a solution somewhere around the corner. Yeah, we'll take Sundered Towers off the wheel. I assume everybody has their gambles in, right? The goal was 20 and a half deaths before four dungeons. We're going to change that to five, and I'm just going to count that as four. Just, just so that we're all on the same page here. So the gamble is instead of five dungeons. All right. Take it up with my accountant if you have any issues. Take it to my lawyers. Good thing I didn't spend that perk point. I'm going to save my game real quick. I'm going to run to the bathroom, pause the timer. When we come back, we will roll. I hope we get illusion or alteration. I don't want conjuration. I don't want destruction. We still have two re-rolls. But I don't feel like using my re-rolls. Maybe we just take re-rolls out of the rule book. You all will be hanging out with my co-host, Chair. They'll be keeping you all company here for a bit, Chair. Why don't you tell them a little bit about yourself while I'm away? I'll be back soon. What songs are playing? Oh yeah, you got the uh, you got the Battlefield Heroes theme song.
I always gotta like squeeze in behind my green screen because it's like it's pretty close to me. Chat, relax. We're gonna have to have a discussion about your horniness, chat. Okay. I'm gonna need a button on here that I hit that will like bonk y'all. Bonk. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? What a grand and intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet Zarabar. Daddy Deuce, I appreciate you. Thank you for gifting five to the channel. Very kind of you. Thank you. What's with the 3PO dance? You don't like that? Oh. Master Luke. Oh, that's actually, that kind of goes hard. Oh. 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 I am bussing it down on the dance floor, Mr. Luke. Master Luke. All right, where are we going next? I gotta take Sundered. What was it called? These aren't in alphabetical order. What was the name of the place we just cleared? Sundered. Whatever, if we land on it, we'll get rid of it. Here we go. Mm-mm. 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 No, no, no. Mm-mm. I don't like it. Volenrood? I think Volenrood is a dragon priest. I think. This could be a problem. We might need to reroll. Where is Volen Rude? Volen. It's not far from Whiterun. It's a fairly easy run. We just have to go back across Whiterun Hold. And then it's right down here. We got Whiterun right here. Volen Rude just a little bit north of it. Not by a whole lot. I have no clue though. I'm not sure what's in there. Yeah, there's a there's a word wall in there, so it's certainly going to be a really tough boss battle. Hey, this is what we do it for. This is what this is why we do our challenges. I'm going to get restoration. I know I'm going to get restoration and I'm just going to be stuck punching things. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> now, this will be interesting. We're going to have to figure out ways to both protect ourselves and deal damage. Possibly re-roll. I want to see what we're able to do, though, with our initial roll. So, alteration. Yeah. I'm not... Thr I'm not thrilled. But we do have stuff in here, like we've got paralysis, uh, we have some healing potions, we have some defensive potions. I want to say in the alteration skill tree, there's some like rock throwing spells. Some of them are completely useless, though. Okay, like, yeah, like this is fucking detonate lock. Stupid. Completely useless. De okay, detonate lock. I'm going to use it if I can. F 
fabricate object. No, I, I have no clue what it does. I think it could be useful. I think it might have utility. Detonate lock, fabricate object. This could be a good one. This could be a good one. Strength of Earth. That could be good. Could be. Could be. Fabricate object. Detonate. Lock. Strength of Earth. Thank you, uh, number again. Oh my god, my typing here. So bad. I had caps lock on. I wish I knew what that one was. This will be interesting, though. Let's go help fabricate. Fabricate object. Why? 1F003902. Oh, wrong one. 03C528. I just gotta add all these to my inventory. It'll take a second. Oh my lord. I keep typing in the wrong one. Timer is back on as I read my spells. Okay, detonate lock. Open a lock with a level 25 points or more below your alteration skill with a shockwave that may alert useless. Absolutely useless. The caster creates a bridge, bed, or crafting station of his or her choice. The object disappears after 132 seconds or when entering combat. Strange, but not entirely useless. A bridge. Holy fuck. We can use that. I can create a bridge over a long fall and possibly lead an enemy back to it and make the bridge disappear, thus making them fall to their death. Let's keep that in our back pocket. We might be alive here. We might have some life. Looney Tunes. <laughs> it is. It's a Looney Tunes kill. Okay, Strength of Earth. Concentrate to deal 40% more attack damage with your other hand. Release after attacking to stagger nearby foes. So if I hold it down in my left hand and punch with my right, I'll deal extra damage. I let go of it. They stagger. I keep punching. I bring it back. I punch. I stagger. We have life. We have life and I will hear no other. I, I will hear nothing else. Let's get ourselves back to White Run. I think that this is a good opportunity for us. Thank you, kind sir. Actually, fastest way to write White Run is Markarth Stables. So let's go Markarth Stables. Fast travel to White Run. Or maybe even Yeah, we'll 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 take care of our a weird view. Which way is Markarth? It's up over that mountain. It's kind of a long way to Mark. Oh, no, 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 no. We hit the river down here. It's a straight shot. We've taken this route before. 
Yeah, we have some punching gloves. Gotta make sure to get these favorited, though. Oh, I still have Highborn. Need to have that on. Strength of Earth. Fabricate Object, Detonate Luck. I, I gotta see what Fabricate Object is. Bridge. Get out of here, what? That's wild. All right, I mean, at least I have a decent... Okay, not, not really good time to use it. Let's try Strength of Earth. Wait, why is it... It's not unequipping that spell, that's strange. There we go. So I hold this down. Ooh. Interesting. Okay, it didn't stagger the wolf. That could have just been a timing thing. We'll really have to see. But I'm glad we at least have some utility. My hope when doing this, when kind of drawing up everything and play testing the challenge, my hope was that we would have a few tough dungeons that we had to manage with utility spells and punching. Apologies to the believers. This could get ugly. Can die four times. Thank you, kind sir. You smell great today. Love the cologne. Thank you. I don't remember what kind of cologne it was, but I did put on cologne today. Is it weird that I put on cologne before a stream? I just, I, it's, it's just a habit. It's like, if I'm gonna smell like something, it might as well be a combination of. What are you doing here? Can we not, please? I don't have anything, I don't have anything here. Their damage output's too high. Let's try and s No stagger. I'm stuck. Oh, I'm so dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. No, tree, cover. Missed the arrow. Woo. Bridge of safety. Bridge of safety. Is this a long fall? Doesn't matter. Stay alive. I'm alive. What was that? It's too dark down here. I can't see. I have no healing either, which is a huge problem. Since I have two rerolls, I think I'm better off spending all of my money on healing potions. Shout out to everyone who taught me about that little loot spot. Whew. That was a nice little escape, though. Sorry. Up the road this way. Do you not heal when sleeping? You do when sleeping, not when waiting. Wait a minute. Heal when sleeping. Fabricate object. Cannot fabricate object in obstructed 1984. What kind of concordant did the Empire will into existence to prevent me from- why? 
No. 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 I don't want to discuss things. Ah! <laughs> how did she learn how to climb like that? Okay, I have an idea. Oh, I'm too slow. She's gonna get in... Go. Quick. Let's confuse her. Cannot a fabricate? Come on! At least let me fabricate an excuse to get out of this conundrum. Pretty much in the clear. Nice, she gave it up. All right, let's hit Markarth. Uh, take care of any crafting stuff that we want to. How high the mountains of sky How can I see? Take a look. Eleven amethyst. Wow. I wasn't expecting to make as much money. So we could potentially leave town with a ton of food and a lot of healing potions. I really don't think that this loadout of spells is going to be good enough to get through the dungeon, but it's worth a try. Oh, we crashed. Damn it. Gosh darn you, Skyrim. You can create, I can create a crashing station. You're right. What's Keck W mean? It's a, uh, it's a 7TV emote. 7TV is like a third party plugin on a browser. Oh, fuck that. I ain't nobody got time for that. I'll save you. Oh, so, oh, really? Really? My right hook is so... I surrender. I sur... I surrender! You try to do one nice thing for these people. One nice thing. Ugh. Sorry, believers. That's a tough one. That's a tough loss. No, I'm 100% cheating my way there. You kidding me? We walked all the way there. Uh, Fleeting TV, thank you so much for the nine months. Uh, and Kazer, thank you for five months. No, now I'm just gonna let you die. I'm not even gonna help you. Nope. I'm gonna go take care of my business. Come on in. The Silver Blood Inn has plenty of straw. This is the Silver Blood. Sure thing. It's yours. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Remember. Why is my phone buzzing? Also, why is my phone in my pocket? Oh, my dad texted me. Okay. Turns Irrelevant. Out there are two wood elf sisters who always fight together. Let me know if there's anything else. Stefan, Steven, thank you for gifting two to the channel. Very kind of you. I appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. Unlike my, my father, Clepper is the one you want to talk to. This is the silk. Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Go. 
Cooking pot up here. Let's hit it. Thank you, kind sir. Mike's out. Thank you for four months. Yes. Not a lot of food. We're going to have to work on that. <clears throat> Let's do... Trading Sons has a lot of money. Just the market travel. We should get back to work. You there? No, I'm not. Take a look. Don't care, Elizabeth. I'm here for one reason, and that's to make some cash. She doesn't have nearly as much as I thought she would. 258. One garnet. Come back whenever you need something. Elizabeth handles the customers. I just check the shipments. Is the Gamba over? Uh, no, we had to add on an extra dungeon because I accidentally completed two. Severely damaging result for the believers. I feel bad for them. I'm going to try my best, though. Should I reroll and get new spells? Maybe. Do I want to see what we can do with sir. these? Absolutely. That's for all the VODs actually funny what to is? watch you get stressed. Uh. Mike, yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you for watching. I do like the stress. I like I like surprise more than anything. Wow, we killed a lot of wildlife. I'm really proud of us. Good work, everybody. Yeah, I definitely do want to upgrade my defense. Uh, no, not yet, or... Uh, you know what I want? <clears throat> I want a mage backpack. Yeah, we'll take a mage backpack. And then let's just grind out a level or two of smithing. I'm not going to be able to get a ton of XP. Leather strips, two leather strips, two leather. No, we want bracers. We want to swap between helmet and bracers because they're opposites. Start with helmet. yourself or deal some damage I guess I could still wear a helmet no I didn't don't give it back to me I literally got rid of the backpack for a reason oh my god he gave me the backpack back no Wait, why am I running up here? I can just fabricate, uh... I might as well make use of the skills while I got them. Go cast your fancy magic someplace else. I'm gonna cast you right here. <laughs> awesome. Oh. It worked! Nice. Fortify Illusion. Very good. I don't really want to scrap this because I... Nah, Conjuration is already really good. And I have to keep the Brawler's Iron Gauntlets for now. What did we get there? Did we level up? No, I still just have one perk. So we could go...
Hmm. I could take an enchanting perk point. I'm trying to think. Let me let me think for a second, chat. Sorry. Go heavy armor. I'm trying to think in the heavy armor tree. This is with Ordinator, right? The Ordinator perk overhaul. Where's hand to hand? I know there's like one perk that will, it, it, I thought it was heavy armor. That might just be vanilla. Where your hand to hand attacks increase in damage based on the armor value of what you're punching with. Light armor might be pretty good though. It's light armor? No way. Iron Fist increases unarmed damage by 5% of your current st ah! We gotta go with it. Let's go with light, uh, light armor. I'm feeling pretty good now. Well, I'm feeling better. I haven't leveled up our alteration yet, though. Did I get any XP? Okay, I did get some. Like, really? Really? We gotta go through all this nonsense just to blow up a lock? My order the yard. Stop right there. Smart man. What crime did I commit? Other than being a little bit obnoxious, I don't really know if I committed any crimes there. Tad aggressive. A, a tad aggressive. <clears throat> um, I still have a lot of jewelry that I need to sell. Hide braces of archery. The Khajiit are probably gone. Where can I, uh... No, the Khajiit are probably gone because I slept for the whole night. Don't have too many potions to sell. Oh, you know what? I'll sell this stuff. We'll take the uh, carriage to Whiterun. We'll be close to our next dungeon. I can tear care of trading in Whiterun. I need to fix my posture, man. My neck, God, by the time I'm 35, my neck is going to be like this. I'm just going to have permanent gamer neck. Where do you want to go? City of Markarth. Where do you want to go? Climb and back and we'll be off. Climb and back and we'll be off. You ever been to White Run before? Happy New Year, friendly wombat. Great to see you here. You need some stretching breaks? Nerd neck is what they call it. Nerd neck. I kind of like that. I wonder what it was like to be a nerd in like the 80s you know when nerd was like a crushing insult look at that nerd yo cassie look at this nerd over here <laughs> you're like um i'm pretty sure that dungeons and dragons is gonna be very popular Hold. City's closed with the dragon. Fine. actually nerds in the 80s totally won 
because nerds in the 80s now dungeons and dragons is at like the peak of its popularity ever and all of the jocks have cte so nerd w Bellathor. Got something just about everybody in here. Everything's I got so much for you, Bellathor. Junk. Me, I call them treasures. Why am I carrying a bucket? I must have just accidentally scooped it. Keep the pickaxe. We'll get some use out of it. Do come back. Happy New Year. I hope 2024 is good to you and your family. Game Goddess, I hope the same for you as well. I appreciate it. Thank you. Come on in. Let me know if you need anything or take a seat by the fire. And I'll... If it's work you need, sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. I enjoyed it's so dumb, but thirsty. it's got to be my least favorite thing in all of Skyrim. Sure thing. I'll show you to your room. No, no, no. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I sleep here every night. Every night. I know it's a, it's a formality. It's good service. You're just trying to be kind. Enough. I know. I know where my bed is. Practically live in this place. Just let me know. You can create your own bed. Stop giving me good ideas. You're right. You're right. I'm getting out of this bed. I'm going to sleep in my free bed. Magic of health, stam. I feel like I should get stamina. I haven't really been running out of... The only thing that stamina helps me with is not dying in the open world if I want to create more separation between myself and, let's say, a saber cat or a pack of wolves. I'm going to keep pounding health. Can I take another light armor perk? No. So do I go alteration? What do we have here? I can cast it again. They become even cheaper. Mage armor. Protection spells like stone flesh are 100% stronger if not wearing armor. Uh-uh. That's not going to do it for me. Cast alteration spells for 50%. Last longer. I'm going to take it. That was a really dumb idea. Well met, the only... Uh, the only... Spell I really have that's gonna do any damage for me here is what's it called? Strength of Earth. Want to hear a little Nord wisdom? Nope. You don't really know a strong. Okay, I know I already paid for my rent, but I'm just gonna throw this in. Sleep in the White Run Marketplace. This is a first. I've never slept here. All right, now the place we have to go is just north of here. Does anybody remember what the dungeon is? They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. Volan Rude. Immersion broken. I have not encountered a single dragon. How's everybody doing today? How was everyone's Sunday? We got a little bit of a haul. It's not too far from here. Oh yeah, Happy New Year, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. I need to check one thing.
Okay, I just had to make sure that the speedrun timer on my recording itself was not overlapping with the gold counter. Are you ever planning on doing something with the Nuka World DLC? I think I would like to. That sounds fun. Ah, oh, fuck. I forgot to buy potions. Yeah, we're heading to the dungeon, but I have to buy healing potions. Completely forgot. Why do you think people celebrate you, New Panther. Year's? I don't know. I mean, it's just kind of a tradition thing. Well, it's, uh, hey, you know, turning over a new leaf. In here. Who a knows? Have any it's a fun excuse to get together with friends. You know, in terms of doing the whole big, massive party. Three, two, one. Now that's corny rather pale could ah so you're an alchemist then you look rather pale you look like dog shit um oh she doesn't have any Come healing anytime if you need a remedy pardon me but do i detect a no i'm i think i'm literally just hungry i'm hungry that's it um do you have polio oh you're you're just hungry <laughs> what if they just started doing that while when you went to a restaurant you sit down to eat you are at the restaurant because you are hungry hoping that the restaurant can alleviate that and your waiter walks up to the table um do, do you have crohn's disease what so you, something looks off I sell cures for all ills, and I'll be happy to serve you. you didn't catch me nice try i'm faster than you i'm more locked in than you are arcadia Mmm, nice try. She's like, oh, this guy's so quick. Where are my healing potions going? What do you need? I think this is the last one in here. I think that's enough. So we still have I guess I could practice. It's kind of I'm I'm kind of realizing now though if I want to fabricate a bridge it's not going to work. Because I think one of the conditions of the bridge spell is if I engage in combat, then the bridge disappears. Thank you, kind sir. I would have to somehow have the bridge up and get an enemy on top of it before engaging in combat. I don't know if I could do that all in just over two minutes. Go steal potions from... Oh, that's a good idea. There are more potions in there. I can come over here, though. There's a little bandit camp. I could get some practice reps in. This is an objectively terrible build, but I could, you know, see what happens. Let's see. How long does this last? Uh, who knows? Maybe the damage is decent. They're stuck in an animation. We're gonna push this bandit first. Yes. Thank you, kind sir. Who? We got to stumble. 
Another punch. Not too bad. Gotta avoid that power attack, though. Oh, okay, getting blocked. Not terrible, though. That's not the worst outcome I've seen. That two-handed weapon's gonna completely wreck us, though. What was the other spell I have? God, detonate lock. We only, we really only have one ability. I know what to do. I know what to do. Okay, we gotta create separation. I'll have your head for Need more separation than that. That's not enough. Why? Wait, why? That caused a stumble. <laughs> Fuck yeah, all right. That, I, I mean, I lived. I think I'd count that as a victory. They're both dead. So I think in order to fully stumble them, I have to hit them and then release it. I could practice on this horse. Ooh, horse. You're going to get me to the dungeon even quicker. There's going to be three bandits that run around the corner to jump me here. We've done this encounter a bunch. I guess I'll take those mushrooms. Absolutely nothing. That's too many. Let's see, can we... Yeah, if you get a hit and then release. I have to run away, though. I can't handle that whole entire fight. <clears throat> so you hold the power active. You land one hit. And then when you release, you get a stumble. And I'm going to have to, if I want to be as efficient as possible, I'm going to have to follow up each stumble with a subsequent hit so that I could then keep my damage up. We'll see how this goes in a dungeon. I should have invested in stamina. Please start killing each other. Yes. Yes. Kill each other. Not me. That's a whole lot of red dots. I think this is our dungeon up here. Yeah, I know my health is low right now, but I want to save my potions. I can summon a bed when we get up there. Take a quick nap. That'll get my health back. The good thing about having the bed is we can have unlimited heals, provided we're just not in combat. This looks right. Not a bear. Really? A bear? A bear? Ah, oh, I should have saved my stamina. Coulda, woulda, shoulda. There's nothing good in that chest, so I'm leaving it. And I forgot to take the horse. I went like 0 for 4 on everything I could have done to make this trip easier. No. Put the magic away, sir. You dick. 
You're so annoying. Bear. Nice and easy. Don't frustrate the bear. I'm not encroaching on your territory, Mr. Bear. I'm not encroaching on your territory. Okay, we can let the horse go away as a sacrifice. Never mind, the horse does not want to fight the bear. Let's just run. The dungeon's right here. Volenrood. Easy. I've been to this dungeon before. I think we can complete this dungeon. We've beaten this dungeon really handicapped before. This dungeon has some sort of small puzzle. You gotta find like the three swords, open up the main chamber. We'll have to see though. I'm already almost spotted. Okay, calm down. I'll try and steal some sneak XP if possible. Hi, okay, I remember. <gasps> I know how to clear this room. I know exactly how to clear this room. We're going to be able to do it. I'm not wasting a reroll. We're going to get through this with just alteration. Just have to push forward. Damn, I can't grab that. Okay. No, 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 go down again. Push down again, come on. Ah, oh, you. Get him. Nice, two down. Fall back a little bit. Let's see if we can break the encounter. Thank Who are you? It's <laughs> just boxing skeletons. No, it looks like he's still following me. He's a restless jogger as well, so he's going to do decent damage. I'm going to pop my head outside. Hopefully the bear's not right out the door. Don't see the bear. Save a healing potion. <clears throat> Bed on the ground. Sleep for an hour. We got our health back. Now we go back inside. Strength of Earth. Back on. Hold on, chat. We have momentum. Something's happening. I need these loose bones on the ground to stop attacking me. He just stepped on the trap again. Step, step on the trap again, please. Somebody's got ice spikes somewhere. Up top. Ooh, close. Ah! Terrible. Fuck off. Okay, it's a drugger white on the upstairs. That means he's got a ton of health. He also has ice spike. That's a big problem. Need to somehow get him off that top ledge. He falls off that bridge. It should be enough fall damage for him to die. I'm going to go back outside and do the bed again. I'm not losing. Not losing. Uh, Zach, thank you so much for gifting one. All right, time out, time out, time out. Relax, relax. It's bad timing for action tunes, but we have some momentum. <clears throat> Bed goes down, alteration up again. I like this alteration grinding we're getting, though. This dungeon's going to take us a while, but I would rather get through here without re-rolling. It's just a point of pride. You know, the, the goal of this challenge was to put myself in very strange scenarios and <laughs> to solve problems. 
in stupid ways. I can definitely get him off that ledge. The ice spike is a big deal. Because with ice spike, it's going to keep his movement very static. Where I need him to try and power attack hit me. I need him to have some sort of unstoppable movement that carries his momentum off the bridge. Ah, crap. I forgot that Sneak takes up my stamina. He's down. He's down. Why did I not think of just doing that? Come on. Come on, please. You know you want to. Can't carry that, it's too heavy. He's coming. Bring it. He he wants to he wants to back up and continue using ranged. I would gamble his ice bike probably hits the bone chimes in front of me. Come on, you're not as creative as you think you are. Push through. Keep pushing. You're almost there. Come on. Don't be shy. Stop it. <laughs> push. Push. Why is he so shy? What do I have in my inventory? Stay right there. Do it again. Do it again. Didn't get enough damage. We need more. Stop backing up. Ah, I can't get it far enough. No, he's going all the way back into his little hidey hole. Oh, he's on the way. I knew it. He's he's going that route. There you go. There you go. Get some confidence. Push. Don't. Do you know how long? Okay. All right, there we go. Cancer. Boom. Another big hit. Boom. Another big hit. Oh, shit. I tried to 360. Get fucked. <laughs> Suck it. I tried to be way too cool. It didn't work out. But we got him. He's down. He's down. Progress. How many more of those are there going to be, though? <clears throat> At the very least, I know that I can get through this dungeon utilizing that trap. If I can get enemies to funnel in through here, which is going to be difficult because their pathing is just going to be <laughs> really bad. Square peg, round hole kind of stuff. But it's possible. I'm absolutely giving myself a checkpoint there, not apologizing for it. That is so satisfying. It just feels so good to just... 
It feels so good to just like, BAM! Boom! Right across their jaw. No, not, uh, not restoration. This one is alteration. Don't like this. Don't like this. I knew it! Don't care, I got the sword. I got what I came here for. They want to try and kill me, they can try and kill me elsewhere. On my terms. lost already getting all turned around uh, I think we just need the axe and then that door will open Honestly, my main goal is to just complete as many dungeons as possible, so using a reroll to get something better would be in my best interest in terms of, you know, the meta of this challenge. But I'd rather... I want to use what I got and get through it. I can box a few Draugr, especially when they're disadvantaged. It's more fun than you'd think punching them out. It's just kind of satisfying to use a limited loadout like this and get some kills. Go back to sleep. Oh, how'd that hit? Okay, it doesn't matter. I'm alive. Let's make a bed. Not gonna waste my potions. Rigged. Whole entire thing's rigged. I know we gotta kill everybody, but I would rather just focus on progressing the dungeon and then worrying about the last couple kills later. I gotta warm up. Do I have a torch? How do I not have a torch? Do you have a torch? How do you not have a torch? All right, cool. It does. It gives me my health back. How can you kill a god? A grand and intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet Zarabar. Hi, Brupai. Good to see you. Thank you very much for gifting five subs to the channel. Thank you. Genuinely means a lot. I appreciate you. It is because of all of your support that I am able to continue making stupid videos. Okay, he's gonna throw... I would rather he throws Ice Spike than do the Ice Stream. And it's the Ice Stream. He doesn't... He's not gonna push up... Yeah, he's not gonna push up that close if it's not an Ice Stream. Restless? You cheating sack of shit! Unbelievable. And I got stuck. Oh, 
I should have taken the death there and just saved, but... I missed. I hate this game. I hate you. Skyrim, I hate you. I'm not losing. I am losing. I go out on my own terms, not on yours. I go out how I say I go out, not how you... Okay, there... Did I count the death? I did. What does restless Draugr even mean? Does that just mean they have trouble sleeping? Like, do they need a better, a more comfortable bed? Do they need better pillows? Come on, Dillweed. Insane range. Which way was it? Oh my god, I forgot! I went the wrong way. Let me think. Let me think. Oh, I wish I had some bones on me. Frustrating. He's pushing back this way at least. Come on, come on down, bring it. You son of a fucking ass. Mm. Try and chase me into this corner. Come on. There we go. We just had to we had to angle his AI in the right way. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking properly. That was good though. Because he was he was floating out to the wrong side and dodging it. He wasn't dodging it on purpose. He's not that intelligent. Don't give him that much credit. Let's see if we have enough room for a bed in here. Why let me cast the spell? Kind of. It kind of worked. All right, one more of these guys down. I am really hoping that there's not too many more in this room. Although, no, it, it's not just going to stop at a restless dragger. Oh, spiders. Nice. Oh, fudge. I forgot about this room. There's no other path around. Another restless dragger. Could ah! isolate this dragger one on one. But it's going to be a Draugr White that's in the other room. That's not the worst. Plus, he's only going melee. This one's going to be a lot easier. He got his licks in on me. That's okay. You can have it. 
gets monotonous. It's still down. Right? That push plate looks like it's still down. It's not. He's gonna hit me. Yeah, I gotta go the same route as the others. Back up, bridge, jump. And then this corner. Now, don't get crafty with your route. Come back here. Come on. This is getting ridiculous. Let's let's go. Come on. You're you're a smart undead creature. Follow me. Oh, fuck you. It's why? It didn't press. one in on him. I think I can hear the other drugger screaming at me, though. Oh, wait, you're a regular? Crap, I forgot I had really low health. Did that count as an injury? Fuck. Did. We've got them in there. I don't think they'll follow me all the way out here. Boom. Big time. Big time. Let's get our health. Another health buff. Take light armor again. No, could I have taken? Uh, I could have taken iron fist. Ah, crap. I'm going to reload. Yeah, of course, the bed disappeared. The bed disappeared and they're both, they're both gonna somehow make it into this room and I won't be able to sleep. Yep. I knew it. I knew it. You know how much I hate you, right? Unbelievable. Ah, oh, I screwed that up so bad. Come on, kid. Piss off. <laughs> oh, wait, it was just there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm getting this sleep. I'm catching it. Yeah. Got it. How many deaths is that? That's only 20. I get one more, or at least the believers get one more. Where the hell did you come from? You know what? I don't care. Catch these fucking hands. That was dumb. Sorry, believers. I got to run through this trap to make sure that it's working. It's not. <gasps> there, I got it. There's an arrow on it. Now it's back. That's simple. All because there's a stinking arrow on it. Yeah. 
another drugger down. <laughs> Slowly but surely. It's all right, everybody, don't freak out. We have 17 hours left of this nonsense. My father wishes you a happy new year. Liam, tell your father I said happy new year right back. Did I loot this? I did. God, I've been in this dungeon for so long, I'm losing track of her. There are three hallways and I'm getting lost. It's like forgetting my ABCs. Not complicated. Oh, no way. It's only a scourge. Oh, that arrow is. Whew. Whew. It's gonna find its way to rip through every single fiber within me. We have to we have to trail him back to the trap though. Or do we? He's got that arrow loaded up ready for me. <gasps> no, he doesn't. You don't got shit. Dick. That actually damaged me, I think. I want to say that that shout somehow got through and hurt me. I can wait all day. I had a standoff with a Markarth guard for 40 minutes doing nothing. You think this is challenging, Mr. Scourge? You about had me there. I'm lost, I'm lost. Too many rocks. There he is, I see you. Come on, learn a new thing. Oh shoot, we gotta move the body. Come on, come on, get off. Get off the trap, hurry! Mm, get off! You stupid son of a... Why are you so heavy? He's coming! He's off! <laughs> That's the most stressful lifting I've ever done. God, that was close. He had like a straight on shot at me. This hallway's really dangerous. He just has a great lane to kill me. He's coming down the stairs. No, what, what is that? Come on, I'm right here. Big hit. Now we've got that door closed on him. He's gonna have to take an extra second to circumvent it. Hop around, hit the stairs. Pray he doesn't shoot us. Hey, hey, jackass. There we go. Dead. All right, anticlimactic is all hell, but he's dead. He's gone, done. Nothing on him. I'm still alive. 
The believers are still in this thing. You're not out until you're dead. You got me? Perseverance. We said it earlier. Few speed bumps. We didn't get an ideal spin. We knew this was going to happen. The whole point of the challenge was so that we would get good spins and then we would get bad spins. We started off with two good spins. We got a questionable spin and then we got an objectively terrible spin. How we manage each of our spins is what makes us. Now, let's not screw everything up by stepping on a trap here. Now, the boss battle. How am I lost again? I swear. I'm losing it in here. Apologies again, I haven't been able to you know, read much of chat while in here, but... This has required the utmost focus. Okay, I'm taking this seriously. not losing but if i've missed anything important now's the time to let me know i don't get why i'm still cold do i have to stand in the fire to warm up gotta get all the health i can what do we have for potions we have resist fire um i'm gonna favorite that that could be important Magicka, stamina, can't do anything with poisons. There we go, we got our last chunk out. Oh, and it, it went back down immediately. Oh, it's because I have an injury. Yeah, I got a minor injury at some point. I don't know how to get rid of that. It might just be there for a bit. Okay, let's see what we can do with this final boss. If I have to, I'm going to take him all the way back to the trap and kill him. I do wish I could have used Strength of Earth a little bit more. The enemies would have to be just a little bit weaker. All right, Kavanel. Kevin L. You think I'm scared of you? Hmm? I may be nervous, but I'm not scared. Okay, there's a couple in here. Where'd that arrow come from? Up top! You sneaky little bastards. Almost got me. What kind? Regular plain Draugr. Nice. I love vanilla Draugr. I gotta get eyes on everything else that's in here. Restless? That's dangerous. Shit. Uh-oh. Ooh. One down. Only took one hit. I have to think for a second. <clears throat> I don't think I'm going to be able to get a uh, Restless to follow me out of this room. I'm going to go back to the other room real quick. There has to be something past the Restless Draugr that I can hopefully use to kill him. Should I re-roll a spell? Should I... Should I re-roll within the alteration tree just reroll one of my spells because like i what, what's the other one i have 
detonate lock. I I should I should re-roll detonate lock. I'll keep it in it has to stay within the alteration tree. I'm gonna I'm gonna re-roll. I have two re-rolls. I'm gonna use one. Yeah. It seems like the haters don't want me to re-roll. Fuck you, haters. I'm re-rolling detonate lock. We're gonna see if we can get something good here. No. Entomb! 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 Yes! 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 Fuck yes! Fuck yes! That is absolutely massive! Woo! I love gambling! I love gambling! You know what I love more than gambling is winning. I love it. I love it. Detonate lock, get out of here, you suck. Entomb, buries a target permanently or freeze a buried target. Only one victim may be buried at a time. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a really, really good one. Okay, we're gonna have to entomb whichever one is the toughest at the time. If I'm able to attack an enemy while entombed, that's broken. Okay, relax, chill, 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 chill. I gotta think, I gotta think. I love the epic tunes, but I gotta think for a second. I also don't know what entomb is gonna do. Okay, that alerts him. I, I was gonna s see if I could cast that silently, but I can't. So we'll bring at least one of them back with us. <laughs> Later. That gives us an opportunity to at least... Oh no. How am I gonna take him out? Can I entomb a ghost? He's certainly gonna have help. I have an idea though. I have a... I have an idea. So... I don't know if you all noticed this. When I entombed the Draugr... When I entombed the Draugr, they were in this animation where they were frozen for a little bit as they went underground. We got life. We have some life. I have to get my magic back. We got our magic back. Can I can I unentomb them over here? It looked like it looked like it brought him out of the ground wherever I entombed again. Someone's behind me. He does. He follows me. He's under the map. <laughs> no way. It doesn't say there's enemies nearby. But he is behind me. So I have to entomb twice. As he goes down, I can get a couple of punches on him. I just have to make sure that we... Boom. Get separation. Now he's almost at half health. 
I have an even better idea. I don't know why I didn't think of this. Chad, you have the same idea as well. You got the same idea as I do. <laughs> oh, I missed you, Mr. Trap. Mr. Trap, you and I are going to be very, very good friends. Don't want to do it that way. We want to do it out here. This is the better angle for us. That's not going to kill me, right? Do you believe in magic? Do you believe in magic, chat? The haters are mad. Haters got to be pissed. That's you have to. That was a gamble. I re-rolled. It was a gamble. Cry about it. Cry about it. All right. Now we get into this next room. Can I take the dungeon boss? Can I get them onto the trap? I have a feeling he's gonna resist in tomb. Which would totally suck. That's a basic draugr. I'm just gonna kidnap them. This is amazing. I've never... What a strategy. You can just kidnap the Draugr, take him into the other room, bring him out of the ground. Now, I could still blow this. Don't get too confident now. Oh, it's a Scourge! Woo! There's two. Why are there two in here? Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, the trap's not gonna go. There's a dead body on the trap switch. Oh no, 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 no. Why are there two red dots? Did I entomb more than one? It sounds like there's an Atronach out there. Shit. No. No! <sighs> no way. Oh, man. <clears throat> I cannot believe this right now. It's a scourge. Gotta move the body. I gotta get the body off of it. He's coming. No. Yeah, he is. He's summoning. <sighs> oh, no. No, it won't charge up fast enough, you useless, useless, useless fucking ability. off, Dwayne. Thought we were chill, bro. If I can capture him, we have a chance. I actually can okay we have the dungeon boss captured 
Dungeon boss is captured. All I have to do, and this is simple, I have to get into the previous room unscathed. Step one. I have to clear off any of the, uh, any of the stuff that's blocking the pressure plate. I have to clear it off. It's just a level one drugger. Okay, learn the word. Got the word of power. That doesn't really matter much right now. You on your own? You better be on your own. This is our escape route. Draugr Scourge. They're on us. They're going to try and shoot us from down there. We can do this. We have to get the Draugr Scourge into the other room. Draugr Scourge goes into the other room. And then I have an opportunity to outpace them. Let's go, bitch. Bring them this way. There they are. Come on. Come on. It's narrow. I know you want to run down this hallway. Yep, they're coming. Don't need that. Actually, that looked like resist magic. Potion of resist magic. That could save us. Nothing in there. Oh, shit. How did they know? Okay, safe in here. There he is. I gotta go for it. I just gotta hit a right turn and go. Come on, stay in that last room. Don't teleport. No, I keep it solo, you cowards. Nice try, bitch. Trap is not active. I gotta lose him. Why is the trap not active? All right, the scourge stopped following. Looks like I'm freed up. Whew! I'm freed up a little bit. So there's time out. I gotta think again. If I have time here, then I need to take that time to free up this trap. I got to get the trap back in play. See how it's now raised up? I think there might just be too much junk around it. Just give me the sword then. Gosh, if you're going to be that annoying... Is it working? I can't tell. If I run through it, it's probably going to get me killed. We're back in business. Now hold on, time out, time out. 
we have to think about this smart. I bring the dungeon boss out from underground. I, I, I think I want to bring him out on this side because then he's forced to come through in a compromised position. However, if that's enough to trigger the Draugr Scourge that's in the other room, I could be in a shitload of trouble. And I don't want to, I don't want to blow this. No, that's not, that's not boss music. That sucks. Whatever, I don't really care. No hit, missed. That didn't really work. I'm gonna try and entomb him again and just revive him on top of the trap. Gotta hit this shot though. His shout does crazy damage. Really? He lost me? How the hell did you lose me? I saw the Atronach up there. Uh, I think it's safer, actually, if I bring him in this way. Missed? God damn it, it missed. this way that's bad come on he's gonna lose me again can't miss this Have I ever told you all I hate this game? Got him. Woo. That was close. <laughs> that was really, really close. I have to double check the trap. Trap still on. I need him. I need him on the far side of the trap because the trap kind of cuts itself off like right here. It's in a really dumb spot. He's gonna get that shot off and do crazy damage. How many potions do I have? 150 health worth of potions. Yeah, I can afford to take one now. Oh, I just don't want to do it from this room. If I fall back, I hit the scourge. If I push forward, I'm dead. I guess I just have to pray that this kills him in one hit. I gotta do something here. It missed. Well, that's it. Game over. Fuck. God. Fucking bullshit, man. Literally had it. Played it so fucking perfect the whole time. Oh, that's just disgusting. Dang. That's frustrating. 
Thank you, kind sir. Fuck. I wanted it so bad. I wanted it so bad. Ah, man. Don't gamble. Is it New Year's for y'all? Did I die right there, right at New Year's? Uh, Norneko, thank you so much for the Prime. Uh, I'm sorry, believers. I did everything I could there. I did everything. Well, I mean, now I just want to get out of this dungeon. <clears throat> so, like, now that I can die as many times as I want. Oh, no. No damage. No. Ugh. Ugh. Maybe he has some kind of invincibility. Your victim has gone insane? What does that mean? What the hell does that mean? Like, Cabeno. Thank you, kind sir. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Why am I pushing this guy? Thank you, kind sir. Oh, uh, what? Now the trap won't... <laughs> I'm gonna cry! That was the perfect... Uh, that was the perfect sequence to get him to step on it. Oh, that's why it didn't go off. I have to drag his foot. Ah, uh, this is frustrating. Now it'll go. Wow, come on. All right, come on, asshole. Hi. Lord Bucky. I can't hurt him with the trap. I can't hurt him with the trap. That's so devastating. Where'd the Draugr Scourge go? I wonder if the Scourge just went back to uh, his scheduled route. Yeah, it's still not cleared. Ah! I'm actually really sad. Woofle, have a good one. Have a good New Year's. I only get one more reroll. I'm definitely not re-rolling the dungeon because we're already at the end of this one. This boss is ju it's, he's just too hard to take out. Oh, if I roll illusion though, I'm screwed. What happened to the lighting? The lighting in this room, like, got all goofed up. Uh, I quick saved. Every time I quick save, it breaks my game. All right, I got I got one more reroll. Int Rise, you're brilliant. You're brilliant. Why didn't I think of that? Chat, that's the solution. <laughs> that's it. Ash Maravel, thank you very much for the prime. Fat Goku, thank you for the prime. Norinako, thank you for the prime. 
Uh, Hyper Pie, thank you for giving that five. Hi, sub, thank you for two months. Pearls, thank you for 100 bits. I appreciate it. Thank you all. Sorry, I missed a bunch there. That's it. I don't want to hear that it's cheating. That's what I have to do. I, I, I should have thought of it before. Why didn't it occur to me? It is cheating? No, it's not. Chat has been saying it for 30... Well... It was... It was worth it to try it the legit way, or not even the legit way. I mean, your way is just objectively smarter. Your way is, is legit. I don't know why I didn't think of that. That's the easiest solution. Why fight the enemy in his home? Why fight this stupid ghost at his home base? Why let him be comfortable? No, 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 no. Mm -mm. I've been wasting time. I've been overthinking this. The solution is simple. You fucking... Okay, the solution is not as simple as I thought. What if I just entomb the enemies outside the dungeon? Would it be cleared at that point? I have a better idea. You, boss man. Go chill over there. I'll be back. I know exactly who we're bringing back to him. Something more powerful than any being in all of Skyrim. And conveniently close by. Mr. Bear! Don't jump scare me, Mr. Bear. We could make a very valuable team. <laughs> this is so dumb, but it might work. Creative solutions, chat. I'm gonna assume that he went back to his own place. Fine by me. That's a ridiculous. We really did. We turned the game into. Oh, timer. Sorry. We turned the game into Pokemon. What if Entombed glitched him out and he just died? Skyrim Bear, I choose you! <laughs> Go get him, Mr. Bear. I'll distract them. Okay, the... Oh, crap, the bear died. All right, all right, the bear wasn't good enough. I need more firepower. Would that make me a bad Pokemon trainer if I get, like, my Pikachu killed in battle? Yeah, that bear sucked. He spent the entire fight just yelling at him. I mean... In Bear's defense, I did keep him underground in like a secret... I don't even know where the hell he was. He was just in the void. I think that would scare any animal. The air is treacherously cold. It's all good. I know how we can defeat him. We will defeat him. 
bring a Yarl? <laughs> Oh man, I, honestly, it's such a tough choice. Do I bring Yarl Bulgriff or do I bring a giant? Both are compelling, but I'm gonna go with the giant. I'm gonna go with the giant, they're right here. Watch me get sniped from Silent Moons. Giant will just get stuck on something? Uh, that room had a pretty tall ceiling. The giants aren't as big as the mammoths. They're deceptively small. All right, Mr. Giant, I have a mission for you. Don't, no, don't struggle. The more you struggle, the more painful it is. What kind of a poke, how big does your pokeball have to be to hold a giant? This is so awesome. I'm glad I struggled for that long, only for the solution to be so simple. I should have just looked at you. I should have just read chat. Although now that we have some spells in our spell bank, that would be really good to grab if we get a perfect clear later on. Now, now I really want to get a couple perfect clears. I want to be able to choose this spell again for sure. This is too fun. How, how long have we been on this dungeon? An hour 15? That's not too bad. I mean, at this rate, we're still gonna complete more than 20 dungeons. I'm so tired. I need to, I need to buff my stamina. Lack of stamina is starting to really add up. Here we go. Greg the giant. Clear this for me, please. I choose you. Get him, Greg. That a boy kick ass. Just come on, use your slam. There you go. There you go. Oh my God, he's losing. He's losing. I'm going to have to get another Greg. He's almost killed Knevel. Come on. Nice. Stomp. Scourge is almost dead. No. They killed him. You bastards killed him. I did the wrong thing. I did the wrong thing. I'm going to count this as a death. I'm going to count it as a death. I know what I have to do. One more try. Giant? Feast, Mr. Giant. Now we take Knevel. He's in our back pocket. What are you doing, Mr. Giant? Useless. Stupid. 
stupid, useless giant. Why didn't he do anything? I trained him. I trained him perfectly well. That's not what I taught him. Mr. Giant, I taught you how to tear your enemies limb from limb. Not to sit there cowardly. Although, my entire strategy throughout this whole dungeon has been to sit here cow cowardly. All right, try again. This time, don't suck. Dude, he got his... Oh, he got his ass kicked that time. I don't know why he's struggling so much. I guess I'll just, I'm gonna let him kill me. Just, yeah, go ahead. No, Yarrow Ballin is just gonna go down. He's gonna do less damage. And then as soon as he gets up, he's gonna go down again. Yarrow Ballin would be almost more annoying to watch. Like, all the giant has to do is get one good hit in there and get him to stumble. He almost had him the first time. God, I hate how long the spell takes. Come on. I got the scourge. Cabeno's almost down. Cabeno's dead. Okay, Mr. Giant, relax. We're on the same team. Go back in the room, Mr. Giant, and chill for a sec. Draugr Scourge versus Giant. Come on, giant. Let's go. Kick his ass, giant! Woo! Atta boy, Mr. Giant. Hey, take it easy. Take it easy. Now put the put the giant club down. I gave you your own home. You should be thanking me. Although I did take him away from all of his friends. <laughs> all right. The dungeon is technically cleared. Mr. Giant, welcome to your new home. I hope you enjoy your throne. Unfortunately, you won't be able to fit your mammoth friends in here. You will be alone for the rest of your life in this tomb and probably eventually end up starving to death. But you have a throne. That puts us at five dungeons cleared, just under four hours. Give or take a couple of minutes because I fucked up the timer a few times. What mod gives that spell? Apocalypse. We're off to a rocking start. Next stream we do is going to have to be really, really long. Uh, and, I mean, we've got some gold saved up. Do I have a Patreon? I do not have a Patreon. Um, I would like to have one so that we could be less reliant on like ad reads and sponsored stuff in the future. But right now I'm not exactly sure what I can deliver on a Patreon. I would like to though. Uh, but my head, my head's kind of starting to hurt today. That was a ton of fun. I only I think that this is only going to get crazier as we continue because we're going to get some even crazier dungeons with some dumber spells. But now that we're our, our heads are thinking, our heads are turning. We're like that last solution we came up with was super creative and fun. Oh, let's raid out. Uh, stick stick around for a little bit. Let's raid out. Let's welcome somebody into the new year. Let's see who's all streaming right now. Um, pa -pa -pa -pa. what is Rexia doing right now? Uh, I'm going to send you over to Jimmy. Uh, if you don't know, Jimmy's one of my favorite old school RuneScape creators. They just make fantastic, fantastic stuff. 
Oh, I just heard myself. I'm going to send you all over there. Jimmy's an awesome creator. If you have any interest at all in old school RuneScape, even if you don't play it anymore and you played it when you were younger, still a super fun channel. But I appreciate everybody. Have a happy new year. Thank you all so much for making 2023 incredible. Genuinely changed my life. Appreciate you all so much. Let's make 2024 fucking awesome with some dope, really chaotic stuff. We'll talk soon.